my friend? I am a free man! I am a free man! I am a free man! You lie! You lie! I come against you. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Out! Amen. In Jesus' name. Amen. Out! Amen. Fire the Holy Ghost! Fire the Holy Ghost! Amen. Fire the Holy Ghost! Amen. Fire the Holy Ghost! Amen. Fire! Amen. Fire! 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 Hey. Lose the house! Amen. Out! Be free in the name of Jesus. Amen. Be free in the name of Jesus. Amen. Holy Ghost are right. Holy Ghost are right. Holy Ghost are right. Holy Ghost are right. In the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. I command you out. Amen. Out. Out. Amen. Out. Amen. Out. Amen. Out. Amen. Jesus. 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 I speak English. Jesus. 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 The agreement that Abuni Akash should have been cut. And that oh, is because of this. See? My freedom is coming so. Trying to hold him. He wouldn't do. He gets more wounded. Hi. Don't worry. I'll fix this. I'll take care of everything. Mama, your family is a great family. But surrounded by unfriendly friends. Hi. Household enemies. Don't worry. Your son. Shall be freed soon. Amen. He must be free. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Oh, amen. I knew it, man of God. I knew Don't it. Don't worry. I know it's man made. Oh. Don't worry. But the people that did this to my son. It's okay. Hey, it's Jesus. Okay. Oh. I shall be I shall be organized to prayers for him. We will pray for him. Amen. An enemy has done this. Amen. It's man made. But don't worry. God! But will break him. You are not giving me my give me you come you 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 the other guy yes you come come come
Thank you. 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 But it will not work for you. The God that I serve will not let it work. The people that have hand in this your, your condition, they will not rest until they release you. Gaba, That's You want to kill me? Gaba, The black men in sub-Saharan Africa are slaves. Nolani, Oh, the black men in sub Sahara Africa are slaves because of this paper. And all the presidents in Africa are slaves because of this same paper. But I, the son of man, can never be a slave. Because there's a cloud from all corners of the heavens. I. Nemeka, why did you leave this house, Nemeka? Why did you leave this house? Do you want to kill me? Why did you leave the house, Nemeka? Why did you leave the house, Nemeka? Why are you stressing your mother like this? You cannot. I know my rights. Hmm. You cannot intimidate me. No, listen, you cannot intimidate me. I know my rights. You don't have to talk to me like a fugitive. It is so condescending and demeaning for you to talk to me in that manner. Hey! I was just returning from the market when Ndidiamaka confronted me and reliably informed me that Nemeka ran away from the house again. Is it true? Is it true? I don't know what to do again. This is just too much for me. Hey! Calm down, Calm down, Calm down. You're just sounding as if we have lost him. But no, no. Eh? We will get to the bottom of this, okay? You when the Columbus invaded Cyprus, they knew that the end has come. Oh, yes, they knew it. Hmm. Listen to me as I speak. Pay attention. Naswajo Ibo. You see, King Nebuchadnezzar, your reign would have been a better one if you had listened to me. You were not paying attention. If you had listened to me as your personal assistant on kingdom related matters, or kingdom issues, your reign would have been much better. <laughs> That's what you do. 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 Munyadim, is there food in this house? It looks like he's hungry. 
is there is a, this food I covered uh, and kept on top of the chair inside the kitchen. I was making his food. Oh, for me to come out and discover that he has disappeared. <laughs> From Udoka's house. They said the Nemeka ran away from the house. And I went to see the mother to know uh, how they did such a mistake. And you left my house to go and see the whereabouts of an idiot whose father's wicked commitments made mad. You left everything you bought and couldn't even cook for me when you are aware that I'm coming back home. Eh? Hey. I'm done with cooking the food. We just left with uh, adding uh, ogu leaves, okay? But a nine. You should be mindful of how you talk about Udoka's family. So people will not start thinking that you knew anything about his mental illness. Woman, I say, my tongue down, strike that you're dating out. Hey. For talking to me in that manner. Nine. Who told you that I'm afraid of anyone saying rubbish? Look, let me tell you, whatever they like, let them say. Mbeka must continue to run mad hey. and die like his wicked father. Hey. For the last time, never in your life, talk to me in that way. Nonsense. Nde Chelsea, e kwen swa ge mero no naga o simba o. Simba o mwa choku simba. E kwen swa ge mero no naga simba o. Ajo mada ge mero no naga simba o. Asena, ono na naga. Ono ne kwen su no naga. Ono na naga. Ono ne kwen su na naga. Oh no, 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 no. Nemeka, with those dirty hands of yours, you didn't even wash your hand and you're eating like that. Macheke Kwaka. Ne. Drop it, drop it. Drop it. Wash your hands. Wash your hands. Name it Macheke Kwaka. Wash it. Wash, wash very well. Wash very well. Your hand. Name it easy, easy. Okay, you can eat now, eh? You have killed me. A boy I, I, I trained in the university with all I have. Look at him now. Negodu. But the people that did this to my son will never go free. They will never go scot free. Hey. Hey. Uwamo. My only son. My only son. Oh. When Comrade Mwawo stood at the Niger Bridge in the eve of the war, no man dares. What a fearless and gallant soldier. Hmm. May Jah bless him forever. Hmm. Amen. And I'm as you go. No. Very well. Hmm? Very well. I do you go. Yes. 
Mm-hmm. Can you see what they below you? Can you see below you? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Eat first. Well, after eating, I won't waste your time. Just I know, I know. I won't waste your time to eat. After eating, I saw oh, no. Is Morocco close to Spain? Yeah, very close. Ah. Excuse me. Excuse me, please. Uh, good morning. Good morning. Uh, how are you? I'm fine. Uh, I suppose you're a student of this institution, right? Yeah. Uh, um, what's happening? Why is everybody looking so scanty? Are you guys on an emergency vacation or <laughs> as well as a stroke again? <laughs> uh, they should be in class. I'm even late, sir. You seem to be looking for someone. Uh, yeah, yeah, actually, um, there is this lady I'm looking for. Her name is um, Chiamaka Ukeze. She's in final year economics department. Yes, uh, she's, she's, she's quite uh, pretty. She has a bulgy eyes, fair in complexion. Oh, I think I know her. You do? Yeah. Please, uh, please do me this favor. You said you are running, running late, but I'll be glad if you do me this favor. Eh? Please help me call her. Tell her Collins came to see her. I already called her, but it seems she's in class or something. So just tell her I'm calling I've been waiting, eh? Will you do that for me? I will. I will call her. Thank you. I'm going to do Thank you. God bless. Thank you. Good morning. Good morning. My love. Oh, babe. Hi. Welcome. <laughs> Thank you. You made me wait too, too long. Huh? Sorry. Why one? I was busy, don't mind me. Good to see you. Good to see you too. Um, I'm so sorry. First of all, I need to apologize. I should have been here yesterday, but I <laughs> my car developed an issue as you can see. Are so you I, yeah. So I went to an automobile workshop to fix it. That's why I couldn't come yesterday. I'm sorry, eh? It's fine, so, sorry about your car. Yeah? I'm not angry. Are you sure? Mm -mm. I thought that was why you weren't picking up my calls now. No, I didn't know. My phone was on silent because I was in the lecture room. Oh, okay, that's fine. That's fine. So you sounded nervous over the phone yesterday. What was the problem? <sighs> my love. It's my mother. She said my brother's condition keeps worsening by the day. Brother's condition? The brother has been ill that I never bothered to tell me. <sighs> Honey, it's a long story. Just don't worry yourself. But I hope to go to the village and return back before two weeks for my final exam. And also my research project is taking a lot from me too. I think I understand. I can relate. No problem. In that case, I'll, I'll send you something, eh? Yeah? You will? Before the end of today, I'll send you something. Just... Thank you so much. For nothing, yeah. So, when exactly are you leaving, sir? Mm, um, I'm looking at three days' time. Three That's days. if I'm done with what I'm doing. Okay. Uh, if I must ask, what's, what's your brother's condition like? What's, what's the matter with him? <sighs> Honey, it's a long story. Mm. The whole thing just started like a joke, and before we knew it, it started getting worse. I can't even explain what is really wrong with you. Kiki, Hi, Yes, we are done. Where did you go? You left when the prof is still lecturing. The prof asked for me. So he called the names of those that do not have his test book. And the book alone carries 13 mark. I'm rushing to the bookshop to buy mine. The bookshop? Yes. Why the bookshop? I thought he sells the book himself. That is what he said. And I'm going to buy my own. <laughs> my dear, I cannot lie to you. I don't have any money to buy any test book. Why? <sighs> it's a long story. 
The only money I have, I want to use it and transport myself to the village. My mom called and said my brother's condition is worsening. I don't even know what to do. Everything we've done to help my brother, all of them, they've been proved abortive. I don't know what to do. Though my friend that came said he will send me some money so I can use and all that, but I'm not sure. I've not seen the money. What if I now use the only money I have to go and buy the textbook? My sister, I wouldn't have any money to travel to the village. So I would rather just stay. If my friend sends the money, I'll buy the textbook. I understand, my friend. Don't worry, I'll buy for you. Let me hmm? go to the shop. Yes, you buy for me? I will. Hey. Thank you so much. You're my friend. You buy for me. Child, if you go bless you. Serious. Why is he saying we should buy the textbook like that? Why is he making him mandatory? So as he stands now, I don't know what is wrong with him. Because we have not seen such in our clan. I know their grandparents. Such a thing did not occur in their time. We have made consultations. Though the whole thing seemed not clear. But the men, the men of that clan should work more so that it does not get to the marketplace. Hmm. But there are speculations that Mas Yudimba knows something about what is wrong with him. Mm. Udemba is in the maker's father's junior brother. Though they had long standing issue when Nemeka's father was alive, and most of the issues we are not resolved even after their, uh, the, the man's death. If he had a hand in Nemeka's problem, I don't know. Time will tell. Because he doesn't care. I personally called him to go and find out what is wrong with he, his brother's son. But he keep ignoring me. But I think you people should call that man to order. Hmm? Tell him to go and do whatever he did to that boy. Because that's wickedness. Gross wickedness. Such a promising young man just, just rendered him useless. Papa, th th this is not nice. Okay, imagine the other day when um, his wife came to see Nemeka's mother. Immediately, Nemeka cited this woman. You need to see the shout he let out. Huh? It, it could be heard the whole village. It was serious. Can you imagine that? But uh, you need to talk to that man. No? I don't even greet him when I see him these days. I'll just walk past him because once I look at that man, I see, I, I see a very wicked and evil man. I don't know what happened between him and Nemeka's father, but whatever happened does not justify what he did to his son. This is somebody's only son. And that's how he, he has rendered this boy useless and, 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 and stupid. What kind of evil is that? Well, it's all right. The time will tell. We will see to the end of it all. I know who you are. By the power and the blood of Jesus, I set you free from bondage of Satan. Be free in the name of Jesus. I cast you out. Lose your host. 
Amen. 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 Lose the force of mighty name of Jesus. Amen. Fire over you. Fire. 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 Amen. Power of the Holy Ghost arise. In the name of Jesus. Amen. I cast you. I bind. Out. Out. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Out. In the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. Be free. In Jesus' name. Amen. I cast you out. How dare you? How dare you make such a derogatory utterance? How dare you speak such derogatory language? Who said I am not free? Tell me! Who said I am not free? Oh! As a great student of history, what happened in Aburi Accord in the presence of General Ankara in the year 1967 was nothing but the breach of agreements. And then the people go back and blame the let's general who fought for the liberation of his people out of love. You, you look like a slave. <laughs> You're a slave, my friend. I am a free man. I am a free man. I am a free man. You lie. You lie! I come against you. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Out! Amen. In Jesus' name. Amen. Out! Amen. Fire the Holy Ghost! Fire the Holy Ghost! Amen. Fire the Holy Ghost! Amen. Fire the Holy Ghost! Fire! 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 Lose the house! Amen. Out! Be free in the name of Jesus. Amen. Be free in the name of Jesus. Amen. Holy Ghost are right. Holy Ghost are right. Holy Ghost are right. Holy Ghost are right. The mighty name of Jesus. I command you out. 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 Jesus. 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 Jesus! I speak English! Jesus! I has it that I, in America, I will fix this nation. I will fix this nation. The agreement in Abu Dhabi should have been cut. And that is because of this. My freedom is coming so Trying to hold him. He wouldn't do. He gets more wounded. Hi. Don't worry. I'll fix this. Hey. I'll take care of everything. Hey. Mama, hey. your family is a great family. But surrounded by unfriendly friends. Hi. Household hey. enemies. Don't worry. Your son shall be freed soon. Amen. He must be free. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Oh, amen. I knew it, man of God. I knew Don't it. Don't worry. I know it's man made. Oh. Don't worry. But the people that did this to my son. It's okay. Hey, it's Jesus. Okay. Oh. I shall be I shall be organized to shall prayers for him. Hey. We will pray for him. Amen. And enemy has done this. Amen. It's man made. But don't worry. God! But will break him. You are not giving me my food. Give me, you come, you, you. You, the other guy, yes. You come, 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 come. Pastor, please help me. I have stepped my foot into some places I'm not supposed to. You are a Christian. And should not allow the devil to drag you into some evil areas. Our Lord Jesus, we save your son. Amen. I believe that evil forces are behind what is passing through right now. Just imagine what happened. Don't worry. Like I said, the prayer warriors will step in. Thank you, Pastor. I am waiting because I am tired. Mm. Of all the money that I have spent, all of them are just gone, just like that. God. Pastor, I am sorry for what happened to your car. You don't have to be sorry. I said I will take care of it. Mm. What about his uncles? Mm. I did not do anything. 
first of all. Please, I don't want to talk about that. Because I, I know that one of them knows what is happening to my son. But my God will expose him. It's okay. Just be prayerful. And see what our Lord Jesus will do. He must be free. The power of our Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. No matter what I do. Why have you decided to hurt me like this? This is not your promise to me. Oh, this is not your promise in America. Why did you destroy the pastor's car? Why? I am not the cause of the gloomy in this nation. It is highly a sardonic situation that everyone must bear. I advise we all go back to federalism. That is the only way this nation would move. Hey! Hey! Who did I offend you? You can't say Joe! Hey! Hey! What is it? Why are you crying like we've lost him? I suffered years of childlessness. And it was so hard for me to conceive. But finally, and God blessed me. I was able to conceive and I behaved the both of you. My late mother-in-law, your grandmother, she almost convinced your father to get another wife. But God answered me. Nemeka's birth changed the whole narrative. And now look at him. Nenia! Oh, no, he's yellow. He did He destroyed the pastor's car. Oh, Jesus, he could have we scream, Pastor. He destroyed the pastor's car. Oh, well, yeah. He's just spoiling this. What? Nemeka? You destroyed the pastor's car. Can I make it here? It's what the nation needs to move forward through federalism. I remember those days when your brother was the crush of every girl in this village. <laughs> Very handsome man. Intelligent. So brilliant. Very hard working. Too intelligent, like Sometimes I ponder how God created him. You know, his name was on the lips of every single young girl in this village. Do you know what they call him then? Watermelon or Momo. Hi, Nemeka. My sister. God has forsaken us on this one. Nemeka was a ray of hope. He gave my family a new life after the demise of my father. But look at us now, now. Our enemies have cut short our joy. They are now laughing at us. The most confusing part is he doesn't even take alcohol. Neither does he take hard drugs. No psychoactive substances. Ama maybe in I don't know. I don't know. Chi. Chi. Take it easy. 
kwe mani he do ku geme ta joye. Eh? You just need to be strong for mama. And believe me, everything will be all right. Hmm? I should take it easy. Amanda, you're not another person. This thing gets worse by the day. Each day there is another thing added to the madness. Eh? Is there anything we've not done to, to, to help Nemeka's case? Amanda, we have gone to many churches, hospitals, psychiatric homes, Kebani Agabe. Yet, everything has been proved for time. We are tired. There is nothing to be done again. Maybe it will be all right. The only thing I know is Nemeka was not born mad. And as long as he wasn't born mad, he would definitely get better. He will. Also, the Aburaka Madumaka more. He will get better. Just hang in there. How's it going? Eh? Hang in there. Everything will be fine. Here you go. Meanwhile, Kemaka Bobogi. How is Collins? Hmm? Hmm, Kenny. How is Collins? Or something? Amanda. Uh huh. I'm a boy. Which one is that, babe? But what is funny? the way you diverted everything we are saying now to Collins, okay? Hey, what, Collins what else do you want us together? to talk about? Not be peace without war. Don't touch me, don't touch me. There cannot be peace without war. I must fight for my freedom. Freedom does not come cheap. The memories of what I read on how over three million of our people were killed is still stuck and truncates me. Listen, this thing is not something for you to get worried about. The most important thing is that there is still hope. Yes, he still remembers what he read in school. Because everything he said now is true. How is it related to this food now? What I meant to say is that there is still something we can do to gain his sanity back. Huh? Me Meanwhile, I think we should stop giving him more of food. We should be giving him fruit instead. Fruits. Yes. With which money? Amanda, do you know how much we've spent on sugar mega? Do you know how much? Me, I'm even thinking of dropping out of school. I'm tired. All of us, we are tired. Calm down. Who is she? Who is she? Just, just take it easy. It has not got into that. Why would you drop out of school? Because of what? Huh? Just, just take it easy. Um, you know what? When I'm coming back, I will get I'll get some fruit for him, okay? Just try and sweep up this place. Then clean it up. No problem, I will. Don't worry. Just take it easy. Yeah. Everything will be alright. Why you why you're blowing cake and in many 
Take it easy. Everything will be all right. You know, go. Catastrophe at the P in Usuka that afternoon when Chukuma and and Tombiga Odomego Juku were invaded by their enemies. But you know what? That afternoon, the invaders died with them. The invaders who suffered from catastrophizophrenia. Oh, what a fallen! The end of a race. One, one. And I'm as well, Yvo! You are good, really good. Hey! Hey! And I'm as well, Yvo! Hey. How are you? You're here? Yes. How did you locate me? Um, from the direction you gave me, I. I was able to get to the marketplace and then I I saw some kids and the moment I mentioned his name, they all seemed to know him. So he's the one I suppose. <laughs> yes. He's my father's only son. <laughs> my mother is dying slowly because of him. <laughs> we don't even know what to do. <laughs> it's okay, no. but I need to know. Be before now, has he been taken to any? They have this psychiatric home or something. Yes, yes. He stayed there for months. <laughs> he has also been taken to churches, but my mom vowed never to step her foot in any fetish place. <laughs> Or even native doctors home. <laughs> that shouldn't be the case because in a situation like this, you have to explore possible options now. Eh? Is the churches you will visit, what are they saying? They are all saying the same thing. Oh. <laughs> they say it's man made. Man made? Yes. I just pray God shows mercy. Shows his mercy on us and my brother gets well. We are tired. Yeah, don't. Calm down, you'll be fine. You'll be fine. Uh, the thing is, eh, before now, did he have any argument? Was he involved in any quarrel with anybody? Like, is there anybody you are suspecting? It's, it's not like we are suspecting anyone. But we know it's my father's brother. My uncle, <laughs> he had an issue overland with my dad. <laughs> Along the line, my dad died. And my brother warned him not to step foot into the land again. <laughs> and after some days, this whole thing started. <laughs> so, so invariably, you're saying your, your uncle is also responsible for your dad's death? 
Yes, yes, I just. Yes, I just pray God shows his mercy. This world is not conducive for myself and my family. We are tired, baby. We are tired. <laughs> Bros, bros, daughter from Obaka, working at Soibo. Mm -hmm. You are good. And you seem to be very intelligent. <laughs> Have you decided on the next thing to do concerning your boy's predicament? Because I'm amazed what he displayed the other day at the end. He's not getting better at all. My sister, I don't know what else to do. But we are we are looking on to God. Eh? We are looking on to God for his mercies. Everybody in this town believes Udemba has a hand in what is happening to your son. Have you tried confronting him? Udemba has not stepped his feet into our compound to check on my son Nemeka. But I don't care about him. All I know is that whatever he has done to my family and my son will go back to him a hundred folds. Amen. Look, I see a very big amen to this prayer. So, But I'm not just happy at all that you sit and sleep over this issue, even to this moment, without doing anything. Eh? There's this Ibu Ade that says, Amen. My sister, what do I do? I eh? have I have tried numerous pastors, but all efforts prove abortive. I don't know what else to do. Amma Rosen, there's this strong prophet I will take you to. That's only if you are true. Because me, I don't like this idea of wasting time on issues like this. Whatever you are with, I will take you to him. That's only if you are true. There's no problem. I will follow you. Thank you. Oh, Thank you. I'll come for my brother. Mm, as you do. I called you here for us to deliberate on what to do about my nephew, Nemeka. Nemeka? Yes. Uh. It is true that I was having an issue with my late brother. Mm. Because he was trying to claim my mother's portion of land, which outrightly belongs to me as the last son. Huh? But my son, just called me that he went to come and take him to a psychiatric hospital in the city. Psychiatric? Eh? Hey. Ozokwa? <laughs> Was it not the place they took him and they said uh, uh, you wanted to kill a staff that wanted to stop him from escaping? That you wanted to take him again? <laughs> mba no no no. Mba no. Ha! Udemba, are you a learner? You and I know that this matter is far more beyond medical. Oh, I go spiritual. And it must be dealt with spiritually. Ha! Ah. Personally, I feel somebody is after that boy's life. Then why are they accusing me? Hmm. Why are they accusing me? Hmm. How can I have a heart of killing my brother? Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Or making my own blood mad? Banner. Anyway, I have taken everything with good faith. Please, just, just take it. Just remo remove it from your mind. So, what do you suggest? Well, Ude, if you ask me to say oh, my own opinion, I feel that um, we have to look for answers. We have to really seek for answers. Even if it means seeking for them in the darkest of all places. No problem. As long as we get solution. Before it gets too late. That is what my I feel. I hope we are not going in the same direction. I don't understand. Because my family is a devoted Catholics. Ah. Yes. Even though your family I will devote the Quensu. No! My own family is a devoted Quensu. What are you talking? Whatever you want to do, you do. As the Quenzu, that is my own opinion. And that is final. Ha! Devoted, devoted Catholic. Because what is keeping him now? I thought, I thought the salary is the salary soup not ready. woman, I'm very hungry. Oh. Please, sorry, I'll pull up. Let's come for my friend. Before he devoted leaves. Catholic. Why Na, thank you for taking care of my daughter. <laughs> 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 <laughs>
Amanda, Mama, good afternoon. No. Good afternoon, sir. Chicken mm -hmm. welcome. Fine. Uh, mm. I brought the food like I promised. Hey, Amanda, thank you so much. You worry yourself too so much. It's not. Thank you. Thank you, you. Thank you very much. Thank you. 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 I know you've not met her before. Amanda, mm -hmm. this is Collins you asked of. Collins, my friend Amanda. Uh, you're welcome, sir. I've heard so much about you. <laughs> <laughs> and thank you for everything you do for my friend. God bless you. Uh, <laughs> it's nothing, eh? God bless you too, eh? Thank you. Uh, apparently, you have a good heart. And that's so admirable <laughs> mm? for a beautiful girl like you. Mm? So you wrote food for Nemeka. Oh, yes, I did. He does not like to eat food, so oh. he likes to eat fruit. Whenever I'm coming, I decide to buy it for him. Yeah, she could go there. Oh, Thank you. Much. Bless you too. She has been helpful since she came back from school. Oh, eh? Mm -hmm. Thank you. Oh. No, it's okay. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. She knows. Her way to the Hindin mountains of Jehoshaphat. She have dots. And she does not have mercy at all. Honor the Mabel. No, not you, the fair one. You were ask the one at the extreme. You may be less space. Can you swear below you, bo? I will take your time. Can I bother, bother? I let's go now. Okay. Sorry. Let us discuss the integrity effect of social media and the impact in our immediate society. And maswajo you, bo. Um, one um, mama. Oh yeah, they'll still come back later, eh? It's so bad. Mm -hmm. Thank you so much. Maka, you see me on. Let me see you to the car. Judge you by your way. Yes. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Woman, Yahweh has asked me to tell you that your son's condition is coming to an end. As you have stepped your feet into this temple. Amen, amen. Mm. <laughs> Look at your son. Hmm? Hey. The boy has a bright future. He has a bright future. Yes. But he is surrounded by an enemy. Enemy in the same family. Hmm. To fear what? I said it. My prophet. I told her, but she wouldn't listen. I know that that boy's predicament isn't ordinary. Eh? Same family again. Hmm. You are hearing you. Yes, no. I can hear you now. I can hear you. Hmm. Woman. You don't have to be. Um, I will write out the list for the sacrifices to perform. Okay. And believe me, after three days, your soul will be well again. He will be well again. Amen. Mm. I will write out the list. Oh, uh, but you can decide to pay on cash. That's if you wish. Um. Mm -hmm. Let me hear from the Lord. Yo, I can hear you. Speak! For your servant is hearing. Mm -hmm. Okay, woman. You can drop a sum of 100,000 for the items. 
and the workmanship. My prophet, Uduka here is my sister and a friend. The money is way too much for us to pay. Eh? My own prophet, please give us a little discount now. Mm. I am surprised at you. Are you praising the work of God? Huh? See, let me tell you something. Our Lord is at work. You don't have to praise the work of Yahweh. What he has started, he will perfect it. Woman, you should go. Our Lord will provide. Thank you, Prophet. Maka, I am totally confused. 100,000 Naira. Where do I get it from? Eh? You know, Chiamaka will be going back to school by the weekend to commence her exams. But where do I get? She needs money to go back. Where do I get this money from? Udoka, what are you trying to say? Eh? Which of these are more important now? Is it Chiamaka's exam or your son's sanity? Which one are we saying now? Hmm. 100,000 Naira. How are we even sure that that man is not a false prophet? Eh? Did you know how, how we have tried to, to, to take care of uh, Nemeka's condition? You know. But everything proves abortive. Nothing is working out. Imano. What you did you? Are you saying that I will mislead you? Eh? Did you? That is not what I'm saying, you know. It hasn't got into this. Be cooking, eh? What I'm got into this and even beyond this. Eh? It has passed it. Eh? How can you even say such a thing? Oh, the man, I'm going to assist you with the sum of 20,000 naira. You know what they said now? A friend in need is a friend indeed. Eh? 20,000 naira? Yes, I will support you with 20,000 naira. Eh? I'll bring the money to your house tomorrow after a key market. Thank you. Thank You're you. Welcome. You are much more than a friend. Mm. Eh? My dear, don't Be mention. Eh? Of course, I need 80,000 naira. Mm -hmm. Eh, Let me see how I can. I can don't worry. Get don't worry. God will provide. Eh? Hey, thank you so much. God bless you. What eh? will I do now to get eighty thousand naira? Beg mercy, Ritty. Don't worry. Don't worry yourself about it, Mama. This Nemeka's case is taking us a lot. And now the prophet is even billing us a hundred thousand naira. <laughs> That's another expenditure. How are we even sure this one will work? How am I supposed to know? Am I the prophet? Eh? <clears throat> Did Yamaka has assured me of him. I, I, I don't know what else to do. Soon you'll be leaving for school and you need money to go back to school. Uh, Mama, don't worry about me. Collins already gave me money for all I need. I can even give you some. That's if you promise me this will work. Anything for my son. Eh? I have some plantations to cut. And maybe when I'm done doing that, I'll sell them and then save up some money for him. Hmm? Where is he? Do I know? Maybe he walked to the backyard. He's even to let me go and get his food. That's even if he will eat. Honestly, I'm tired of all of this. I, I am just so tired. I don't know what else to do. Tired. It's okay. Tired. Hmm? Let me just get his food first. Also, also succumbed to the idea of seeing a native doctor as opinion by Okonkwa. Eh? I insist you keep praying and waiting on God's time. Eh, well, we always share in this school of thought. That is what our Catholic teaches. Nevertheless, we have fasted, prayed, and booked several masses for Inemeka. But his condition is getting worse. Hey. His mother and sister are over there 
spreading my name, telling people that I'm the one holding their son. Eh, no. Well, you keep saying yes to that. Look, woman. Stop disturbing my time with Inneneka's issue. I've told you this before. Allow me to stay in my house. There is nothing that I will do to replace that woman. Can't you reason that? Moreover, you are the one that suggested the idea of bringing a charismatic brother who almost made away 300,000 naira from Chino so on in the Mekas issue. Hmm. Look, woman, anything you intend doing, ensure that you did not involve my son. After all, nobody knows where in the maker got this incurable madness. Why the idea? Accusing an innocent man. She also doesn't remember all this. All he wants is for his only cousin brother to be fine. And that is where I stand. I stand to get a good jig if I know. Come on, Jip. I'm not so poor. No, they must. Come on, Jip. My biscuit bowl. <laughs> I mean, so you have been avoiding me all this while that you came back from school, thinking that I'm being infected with the coronavirus. <laughs> hey, God, not again. Why did I even take this direction? What is it? Forget about that thing. It's a love. Bro. It's a love. Love in a woman can go. <laughs> see, see, see. I, I, I know. Or do you want to hurt me? See, wait. Mama, put a the money. Mama, put a the egg. Listen, Kokoche. Yeah? Stop following me around this village. You're embarrassing me. This is the last warning. Stop following me. What is it, self? It's a love. Bro. It is under a little love. In fact, I love you both spiritual and physical. In fact, I am the only person that can marry you. In your brother's condition. <laughs> you are mad. You are insane for trailing me with my brother's condition. Uh -huh. Idiot. <laughs> Hopeless, useless, never do well, drunkard. Stop me again, you see what I'm Come on, will you get out? I got it. Forget about that, you know. Forget about it. In fact, I know. Uh, uh, your brother is mad, automatically mad. See, it's your brother that needed urgent attention, not to me. He best knows the one who incurred madness. On him. <laughs> if you look now, I am a perfect a village drunk. I am far away better than that mad graduate you call your brother. <laughs> look at me. Look at me. You are hopeless. Me? <laughs> look at me. Look at me. I'll cut you, okay? I'll cut you when I go past it. I don't mind them, please. Nemeka is surrounded by a lot of friendly enemies but he hardly keeps friends except Nandi, his childhood friend. No, it can't be Nandi. Could it be his cousin, Nonso and his father? Mama. Good afternoon, Mama. Hey. Ne. You look so worried. 
Mama, you can't continue like this. Eh? It was a Mama, please now stop doing this to yourself because you na. Oh. Mama, do you know what? Let's just go inside. Oh. Oh. Kaiban, Mama, you can't be doing this. Who's going to Please now. Mama, pity for you. Mama, no one get better. Please. Oh. Mama, let's just go inside. Enter inside. Eh? Mama, if you continue like this, I'm going to do it. Hmm? much we've suffered in the hands of fraudulent people, all because of my brother Nemeka. If you ask me, we have exhausted all our options. The only thing left now is for us to be prayerful and remain hopeful. When your father died, I suffered and sacrificed a lot to make sure that the both of you does not lack anything. I, I, I cannot fold my hands and watch my only son waste away. No, I will not. I, I, I trust in Didi Amaka. She will not mislead me. We have come a long way hmm. to follow her. Mama, I am not comfortable with this whole arrangement. If you ask me, I suggest you wait for Nusu. Who is going to come back any moment for me? I, I don't want any help from them. I don't even know where my son's predicament is coming from. Udimba is a very wicked man. He's wicked. I want to totally avoid him. I, I want to reject everything, anything that comes from that man. He's so wicked. And then, you know, I will, be, I will not fold my hands and, and just watch my son waste away like that. No, I have to make a move as his mother. I will make a move. Mama, you have to be very careful now. Let's not go and enter another problem while we are seeking for solution. Eh? Be careful. I am. I am hmm. careful. Yeah, what will happen to me? You think I'm a very wicked man. Eh? And he needs to be avoided. He's wicked. I am aware that you, Ndidi Amaka, you took Jamaka's mother to see fake prophet Dan, right? And where did you get that from? Of course, now we get the village. Mm -hmm. I saw both of you coming out of his chambers. Now let me ask you, are you sure that prophet Dan has all it takes to kill Namaka's madness? We all know that prophet Dan has been in this town for a very long time. And people are fully patronizing his ministry. Are you not saying he's fake? Of course, he's fake, dear. He's fake, you and I know. Ah, what are you telling me? Anyways, uh, I don't mean it like that, though. The first one I want to the whole matter. Now, but what I want you to understand is that lands have been sold in this case. A lot of money has been spent in this particular case. Even also, two have done a lot. Now, you taking Chiamaka's mother to profit Dan is another money. But if you trust your prophet Dan, Carry on. But if you know that Prophet Dan is fake, like you and I know that he's fake, let the poor woman save her money until we all find the solution to the madness. Did you get me? The idea is good, but I strongly believe there is no harm in trying. So let's give it a trial. If you need to tell that Prophet Dan or Blue Fake, did you make Nga coordinate men. Nga coordinate boys. Nga coordinate for youth. Yeah, him get tiggy. I will pick you. What's your problem? I was going to that. All I know, Prophet Dan is not safe. Let's just give him a try. There is no harm in trying. Let's give him a try.
I miss you too, baby. <laughs> Don't worry, I won't be long here, okay? <sighs> My brother is getting better. Yes. Don't worry, I'll soon come back. Before midweek, I'll come. At least I can sit for my exams. <laughs> I miss you more. I love you. Bye. I am heading to Ndidiamaka's place. Mm -hmm. Make sure you watch over your brother. And please be conscious of when he wakes up. Mama, but the pastor called. Aren't you going to wait for him? I have an important appointment to catch up. On that same old, uh, pastor call. You are my seed. And your mother is no more. I refused to remarry because I had my other children from my first wife who left with her children because of your mother. Even when I know that your mother was a good woman, What is really wrong with my daughter? Let me know. Tell me. Did anyone hurt you? But most nights, you cry. And whenever I ask you, you say, Papa, there is no problem. Yet you pour out more tears. Papa, I am fine. I am just sad because I feel alone most of the time. I feel like I have no one. My mother left me. And the ones I call brothers don't even consider me a sister. They don't see me as their sister. When someone hurts me, when something happens to me, I have no one to run to. I have no one to fight for me. So it makes me sad. It makes me feel dejected. Your father is not happy. Anytime I remember that your mind is not at peace. What is it that is troubling you? Tell me. I know it is not your mother's death. Not even you are brothers who do not care for me. If there is anything you lack, tell me I will provide that for you. Huh? Have you paid for your hostel accommodation? No, Papa, I have not. But remember, I told you I, I want to move out of that hostel huh? to another place. Do I have contacted an agent, so I'm waiting for him to get back to me before I go back to school. Yeah, it's all right. If you feel that uh, you don't want that place, you can relocate to another place. Uh, you only have one year left 
So my daughter, cheer up, right? Cheer up. No, I'm fine. I'm all right, I'm just... was a good woman, but the God wouldn't have dated her. Flora Shaw went and dated Lord Lugard out of so much desire for wealth. Ooh, 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 ooh. Playmaker. So you've gone inside the room to scatter my bags, so okay? What is even wrong with you? So it's because I told Mama to remove those chains on your leg. Now you're scratching everything in my room. Can one for? When I went to Congo to meet with the brothers of Jehu, they were astonished to meet with a very vocal historian of the first century in Bahamas. Oh, there is a cool place that you would enjoy only when you have Kaya with you. I don't know if you're gonna hear this. I will return you to see it. You don't have to complain. I will take you back to the Senate. But when you get there, make sure you return the Constitution to where it should belong. Do I make myself clear? Oh. What a handsome young man. Hmm? Whosoever did this to this young man, we know no peace. How is your mother? And I hope he is not violent. This time. Ichiakukwe, my brother has never been aggressive. Else he's triggered. Okay. Nemeka, give me my wig. Nemeka, give me my wig. Nemeka, Nemeka. Just look at handsome young man. What kind of thing is this thing? This boy has a tag of bounce. Man, in a quack, what is boy? Kim Madu, Kim Madu. Welcome. How is Amanda? Uh, well, that's exactly why I came to see you. Ichi, please, you can see it. Thank you. Mm. Uh, have you noticed the changes on Amanda of recent time? Even in school. Yes, Ichia Kukwe. Mm. I've noticed recently she's usually on her own. Mm -hmm. Sometimes she would even lock herself in the room crying. Oh. She wouldn't go for lectures. She's just been behaving somehow. Most of her departmental mates have even complained to me. Well, because we are not in the same department, there's no way I would follow up like that. Uh, Amanda has been your childhood friend. She should be able to tell you whatever that has been troubling her. She cries throughout the night. Even when I try to find what her problem is, she wouldn't tell me anything. I wonder what is wrong with my daughter. Remember, she hasn't been behaving like this, even after the demise of her mother. Ah, I do not know what exactly is wrong with my daughter. It's you. I would just have to follow up more to know what is exactly wrong. Mm. But it's not like I've not tried to find out the problem, but she wouldn't let me into what is the problem. Yeah. I am troubled as we speak. I will not trade anything with that soul. Yeah. God save, who save has done anything 
whether human or spirit, to my daughter. Uh -uh, please, as you guys return to school, make sure she is all right. Hmm? Try and find out what really is troubling her. I beg of you. It's okay, Chi. I promise to find out. It's okay. I will. All right. Thank you. Bye-bye, sir. Thank you. Uh, greet your mother for me, huh? Thank you, sir. Thank you. But it's not like Amanda has shown any sign of being broken every time she comes here. But something is really not okay with her. There's something. Judge Jehovah Emmanuel. Judge Jehovah Emmanuel. Hmm. 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 Rejoice, for liberation has set in today. Amen. <laughs> Yahweh has taken over. Yahweh has taken over all your problems. Amen. <laughs> hmm. Drop them on here. Uh, uh, uh. I hope the money is complete. It's complete. <laughs> if it's not complete, <laughs> you can't fight your way. <laughs> you can't fight your way, woman. Mm. Okay, um. I'll be fasting and praying indoor for seven days. Seven good days. Seven good days I will be with the Lord. Mm. And I will give you olive oil to rub on his forehead for seven days. And after that, your son's sanity shall be restored. Amen. Amen. Thank you, Prophet. Thank you, Prophet. One more thing. You must ensure that no one hears about this. That won't be a problem, Prophet. Uh, but I was hoping you would uh, tell me the cause of his mental illness and who did this to my son. Woman, that won't be necessary. The good news is that your son's sanity is going to be restored. Our Yahweh is at work. Though I told you from the onset that the problem your son is having is from the immediate family. But our good Lord is at work. It's going to be okay. You people give me some minutes. Let me prepare and pray over the oil. I can't thank you enough, my good friend. Eh? What would I have done without you? His way is simpler than I imagined. I told you. That man is very powerful. Eh? Don't mind all these eh, pastors that will keep giving you numerous psalms to read as if you are writing for Waye. Mm -hmm. You heard it from him that Nemeka's problem is within the family. Now tell me, who else? Oh, damn, man. Oh, no. I knew it. <laughs> but I'm so happy that the miracle is happening already. Amen, Mo. <laughs> Amen. But hey. remember, he says no one needs to hear about this. That means you have to caution your daughter, Chiamaka. As for me, my children are not around and I wouldn't even dare. I, that won't be a problem, mm. my friend. You okay. see, Chiamaka doesn't even talk much. Oh, whoa. <laughs> It's not a problem. Mm. I'm so happy. <sighs> Thank you so much. Mm. I, I know that there are still good men of God out there. Mm. Mm. 
They are round. Hey. They are round. See? I believe that one. I believe you. Holy Ghost fire, Holy Ghost fire, Go oh Lord, come down and manifest your power. Go oh Lord, come down and manifest your power. Jesus, come down, come and manifest your power. Oh God, come down and manifest your power. The mighty name of Jesus. Amen. And tie every evil rope. Amen. I break every evil chain. Amen. In the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. Oh, you yoke of enemy. Amen. Be that broken. By the power of the Holy Ghost. Amen. In the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. The Bible says on that day, I will unfold your body. Number 19. Yes, shall be broken. Amen. Every evil yoke is broke. By the fire of the Holy Ghost. By the fire of the Holy Ghost. Fire. I set you free. Amen. I set you free. Amen. I set you free. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Be free. In Jesus' name. La Harabaka Sender Abaka Sinda. Li Harabaka Sarabas. La Harabaka Sinda Bas. Li Harabaka Sarabaka Sinda Bas. Sabos. Li Harabaka Sarabaka Sinda Bas. Jesus. Arise. Arise, O God. Arise, O God. Arise, O God. And scatter the enemies. In the mighty name of Jesus. We are free in Jesus' name. Every chain is broken. But the fire of the Holy Ghost in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. 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 He's come today. Unlike what he did to me the last time I was here. We are sorry, Pastor. My mom told me. Please, we are sorry. It's okay. As I was praying, I got a revelation. Yes. The Holy Spirit ministered to me something. Thank you, Jesus. Mm. There's something he did that brought this upon him. Yes. He brought this upon himself. Pastor. I want you and your mother not to point at anyone. No uncle did this. No brother did this. Jesus. I'm seeing something in the spirit. I'm seeing something in the spiritual realm. They understood to be a spiritual chain. Please, when your mother comes back, please tell her to see me. It's very important. Okay, Pastor. Bros, are you free? In my chance, guys, where you go? Devil is a liar. Pastor, please, we are sorry about your car. Hope you fixed it, sir. It's okay. You know, out of fear, I wouldn't come here with it anymore. Though, I packed outside. Ross, you be free. I saw you go. That is a lie. Amen. That is a lie. Amen. I will be on my way. Ah, Amanda, no, this one you're washing by this time, what is going on? My sister, Pastor George came here to pray for Nemeka. Before I could accompany him and come back, Nemeka has thrown the whole clothes that I washed and spread. Can you imagine? Yeah. Anyway, don't worry, let me help you. Huh? You have to help me. Mm -hmm. Let's make it faster. <laughs> Wash and I will reason it. Hmm? No problem, my dear. Meanwhile, um, I came to tell you I'll be going back to school tomorrow. Eh. My dear, it's good though. Lectures are started already. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> 
Chimamanda, hmm? that reminds me. You had to bring back the behavior you were exhibiting in school back to your old man. Eh? Why now? He had to even come here to ask me if I knew what was wrong with you. But I told him I don't know. Eh? Chimamanda Akukwe. Thank God we are no longer in school. We are here now. Can you at least tell me what is wrong with you? Biko no. Where is your brother Nemeka? He is probably at the backyard sleeping. But what is, where is my brother? Is that what I asked him? The devil lives in this house. And that devil will not go scot-free. He will not go scot-free. Chimamanda! Chimamanda! Come down! Another man will serve her breakfast. <laughs> yes. What is this wretched drunkard saying? Eh? Eh? What is your problem? <laughs> See, will you get out of my sight before I hit your head on the wall? Huh? And we ain't making it see. Who? The one the judge. The one the judge. See, judge people. <laughs> Very soon you'll be speaking in tongues. You See, I have a question for you, a very important question. Why you, Reverend Father and their friend, haven't found everlasting solution for Namaka's insanity? I thought both of you are communicating with God one on one. And now I said, I'm speaking in tongues. You have broken the rubble, I linger the rubble, I the like I saw Come on, get out of this place. <laughs> I'm not afraid. You don't know me very well. You don't know me very well. If you know me very well, you will know that I am Akadji of Four. You will Oh, well. But I'm, in fact, I'm the Akadji of Four in my kindred. I see all things that you people cannot see. But my problem is, you people don't follow me. You don't follow my gift. Yes. Nemeka committed abomination. I mean, our... That's your gun. See, having taken something that doesn't belong to him forcefully is out of wickedness. And the oracle sealed my mouth not to talk. But anyway, I have a solution for it. You people need to go and consult the gods. If you consult the gods, then you can equally come and buy me more drinks. <laughs> if you buy me more drinks, then you will appease me. Ibu anu ofia. Eh? Kita kam fun isi adroge mwa. Why you? Come on, get out! Why you? Go and provide that maka for me. Go and provide that maka for me. Why you? See, so go and buy the drink. If you buy the drink, you buy, uh, what do you call it? Ah, uh, no problem. Nidjot, Nidjot, la brosunda yaka say, 
Vamos na cadeira, eu vou ali, eu vou. É, a Tonya. Hum. Nossa. I do not know what Okonkwo and your father are up to. But all I know is that my son isn't going to invest his money or partake in any kind of diabolic act. Mama, Mama, there's nothing diabolic here. And where did you get diabolic here? Eh? Mama, my brother is sick and his condition is giving me sleepless nights. Eh? We have to weigh our options. And seeing a native doctor or a herbalist is never an option at all. Jesus is the only option. Wow. <laughs> My son. Papa, good afternoon, sir. You are back. Yes, sir. Welcome. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You did not even bother to call and inform me that my son is back. You're still going to know sooner or later. Now you are home. Okay. Whatever both of you are discussing should not be about Udoka, who has been parading my name and the name of Nunso in this community. Tell everyone that we are responsible for that boy's madness. Oh, I, I cannot accept that henceforth. I never. Um, Papa, calm down. I do understand everything. But Papa, I... Mama was just telling me that you had a plan with uh, Okonkwo mm. to do something about it. Yes. Okonkwo came here with a solution. And I waved everything off. The more I try to show concern, the more they keep on parading my name. Keep on telling people that I'm responsible for that boy's madness. How can I do so to my own son? Eh? They can take off the land. But Udemba to be accused again against that boy, I will not take it lightly with that person. Never. I do understand everything, okay? Eh? I'm a Nakadi Bacha. Yes, and nothing will happen to you. Okay? Hmm? Papa Butu, 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 Mimi, my biscuit bone, my bone and kill, my vertebrae, my backbone, my liver, my otondo, my over. Oh <laughs> I'm not talking to you. Can't you see? See? <clears throat> oh, 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 what? I, I, I want to ask you a very serious question. Have you accepted my proposal? Oh, do you want me to change my mind? <laughs> Okochi, hmm? this will be the last time you touch me without your miserable hand. Don't ever try it again. All you know is just to be going around this village to all the beer palace begging for free drinks. What is even wrong with you? Oh. <laughs> it is far away better than all these confused people that are going around seeking for answer for the questions that they raise for themselves. It is better, properly better, to be a drunkard or a drunk than be a mad person. <laughs> you are miserably mad. Eh? You are a drunk. Hmm? Your father was a drunkard. Eh? Your entire family, they are drunkards eh? and they are going to die drunk. <laughs> I'm not fear. Oh, <laughs> Ooh, see, I want to ask you a question. A very simple question. You see, my family, are they mad? Eh? The answer is, well, <laughs> they are not mad. See, it is a time that you will accept my proposal before this young man that is enjoying your sweet ways will run away because, because of the madness in your family. <laughs> How are you standing here listening to you? No, come here. How are you? How are you? 
don't touch me again. Uh, if you don't want to die, don't touch me again. Last warning. I don't want to die. Huh? You want to die? You, you can crush me, my love. My love, you can't hit me. You can't hit me more harder. Oh, harder. Oh. oh. <laughs> <laughs> Oh. <laughs> See how your hand is testing very, very sweet. If I enter the other side, <laughs> oh my God, how sweeter is that side? <laughs> oh God! <laughs> You went to buy food stuff. I'll be very, very mad at you if my son has not eaten since I left. What is it? He has been. But he had to spill the whole food on his clothes. I had to start to clean him up. And that's why I went to market late. Eh, hey, Mama, there's something I want to tell you. You see that useless or coach a boy. You need to warn him. Anytime he sees me, you'll be calling me madness family. Please uh, ignore that uh, Okochi. Is Okochi well? Eh? Is he not a mad man? No, don't listen to whatever thing he says to you. He's mad. He's not normal. And again, eh, eh, there's something I want to tell you that is very important. What is it now? I don't want you, no matter what, to disclose my movement within the Diamaka. You know, you know this movement that I'm, I'm, I'm going about your brother's condition and for the, uh, the good of the family. I don't want anybody to know about it. Biko, Mama, no problem. I won't disclose to anybody. No go. Oh, but Mama, you don't look happy. Did anything happen? Chamaka, how do you expect me to be happy in this your brother's condition? Eh? How am I supposed to be happy? Kedu, get a messy the happy. Mama, do I understand? It's okay, oh. Let me make something so you can eat as well, oh. I don't have appetite to eat. Mama, you eat. Let me eat first, you eat, oh. Mama, what do you know, so my son? Papa. You are indeed a brother to Nemeka. You tried in rushing him to psychiatric. Immediately you found out that he was running mental. And I know how much you spent. I'm glad about that. Thank you, sir. But for the fact that that woman is still accusing me of being responsible, that charity organization you are running in that house must come to an end. And I mean every inch of my word. Papa. Papa Chinonso. Papa, I know you are a good man. And every other person out there knows you are a good man. Now the last child inherits what belongs to the mother. That is your only sin. <laughs> Papa, listen. Our main concern should be Nemeka. How Nemeka will get on his feet again. And not all this thing. I forgot that quite for now. You know very well that we have tried. The mother also. Even the pastors. But what is holding in the Mecca is a very strong thing. 
I heard that he demolished the pastor's car. Who came to pray for him? It's not ordinary. Papa, um, I will go and see them later. Because it's somehow me coming back without going there. I'll go and know the condition of Nemeka. Nemeka is my blood. He needs my help. Huh? Papa, listen. Forget about all these things they are saying. Me Mel and Mao, me Mel and Joe. People will still talk. Huh? I'm no longer interested. Nemeka is like a son to you, Papa. And I know you very well. You can't hurt him. Papa. Relax. Okay? Papa, you know. Do whatever you like. <laughs> Papa, you know. Do, so. and do whatever you like. Papa, calm down. Okay? I saw English. Yeah. Okay. Do you know that if it's not for the timeless efforts of the likes of the comrades that fought with your ancestors, you all wouldn't have been alive today. I'll tell you this for free. General Madwebo. Oh, what a great general he was in the army. And Tombriga Odumego Juku. And General Philip F. Young to their blessed memories. Those were the men that fought the war that preserved you all. Even though the amalgamation was considered as known and void. Hi! What can mean as English? Yeah. Find the man in you. Get rid of your goodwill. Your goodness is beginning to lose its continuity. You have gotten to the Rubicon of being a nice man. Hey, oh, what came? What came being a so evil? Hey, hey, not making a so evil. Oh, daughter from Mutie, boy, not so evil. 
I'm not like a, um, no problem. Let's go back home, okay? I've got a few things for you. Let's go, let's go. Now. Let's go, okay? Let's go. Okay. In my space, guys, so you go. I am space. There are four basic things that inform our opinion as human. What we were told, what we saw, who we are, and what we read. Now with these four points, you take ex oh shit. English. Do you both from Boy, you're so good with English language. Hi, my brother. Uh, you know what? Um now. Um, let's go back home, okay? I've got a few things for you. You will like it. You know I like you so much. I want no more. You want space? I want space. Can we speak English? So what now? What now? Get get Eh? Dim Odume Goju could not made it out alive. Mane is Yoko. He was a great man. Is Yoko Kabo? But they foresaw a different version of him. Oh yes. Oh yes. He was beyond the strength. Ah. Bam 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 bam. The amalgamation was forced. It was declared Noid and Boyd. I know. Are you aware of that? I know. I'm aware. I'm aware. In Asukwa Ibo. In Asukwa Ibo. In Asukwa Ibo. Let's go home. I've got a few things for you, okay? Eh? Let's go now. Eh? Who made this guy to be dark at the day? Who made this way? To blood. Who led the evil out of the cage? Who? 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 Who led the Where did you find him? Eh? The sister had just gone back to school this morning. Can they for you? Oh, on the way, even some kids were following him up and down. Uh, uh, Mama, what do we do? Eh? Since you and I may about this boy called them, my woman telling where you see. Mama, what do we do? Eh? And then, uh, Mama, I heard that um, you've been carrying my father's name everywhere, that he knows what happened to Nemeka. Mama, why, Kwanya? Nekwanya, I will not entertain such questions from you. Biko, what, 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 what do you mean by why are you carrying my father's name up and down? Your father knows what is happening to my son. He's aware. He knows about it. Just barely one week, just barely one week, my son stopped him from entering his, his father's land. And this happened to him. You know, I said, your father, Amaro, you Basalia. Eh? Listen, let me tell you, whatever thing you brought, just take it back because my son will not touch it. The only person that has good spirit is your mother. If Ulungi and your father, you people are evil. One of the evil. Especially that your wicked father. Because bully I say about just go, 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 go. I don't want, I don't want, don't give my son anything. Mama. Mama, are you aware that Nemeka is the only brother that I have? Let me tell you something. Take this allegation out of this family. Odiroma, and tell whoever that told you that to come out and say it. Mama, Mama, what we should be talking about now is how Nemeka will be well again. Noburu Dakuka, drop go to this one for now. Uh, anyway, um, I'm going to see Okonkwo. He has a solution to Nemeka's problem. Okay? That name you mentioned, is he a mathematician? What can he do with algebra? Tell me, does he know the algorithm? Has he solved econometrics in the past? If not for the fact that I am the Otomina classificational totality of all English language, the imperial rule of grammar, the Shakaramushu Shu, of all spoken words. 
Oh, you boy, if you if you know that, oh, boy, if you see me on the road, you clear. What? Um, Mama, I'll be right back, okay? No, no, quick, Fabia, Bulu, come and carry it, carry it, carry it, because I, I don't, my, my son will not touch it. No, no, listen, I bought this for my brother, and not you. Do not throw it away. Atu fukwenia, I bought. Anyway. No. Like it. Hmm? Uh, and um, listen, listen, listen. Neganti, neganti, neganti. I don't want to see you outside again. I now marry now. Tafu kai marry be your problem. Eh? Don't go outside again. If only the bishop will allow all the clergymen in the parish to concentrate. I am on Instagram. Um, Mama, I'll be right back, okay? Mama, all the families cannot just fold their arms and, and watch in America. Fizzle away, all because of belief. I know your father is not happy because of the allegation Udoka uh, uh, leveled against him. But I told him, nah, rapo, forget that one. Take it as woman talk. Eh? Ignore her and move on. Kangwakwagyu. Nemeka is your father's only brother's son. Oman Nakwani! You guys have to find a way to revive him. Ichi Okongo. You know my parents stand in the church. I know. I know. And I understand what they are protecting. Hmm. I will do my best because I know that the old man is not happy. Please do your best. And I promise you that all shall be well. Amen. Um, I want to thank you for everything you have done. All you have done for your, your cousin brother. Odi Izi. Dike Kiu. You're welcome. Mm. You're welcome. But please. Forget that land. You see, the truth is that your father would not have talked about that person of land in the first place. Since his brother gave him a very mighty portion. Oh, can you see? I told him, leave that to your mother's heart. Oh, you? People who started advising him otherwise. No, no. Go and tell him that I said so. Gagwe. Nikuru. Um, it's your Congo. Hmm? I've taken my decision already. Hmm. And I want to use this medium to thank you for your advice. Yeah, yeah. No, don't, don't, don't mention. Thank uh, you so very much. You're my son. You're my son. Uh, thank what you, else? Sir. Thank you, sir. <laughs> One more thing, my son. Okay. You know that a family that madness has affected. It becomes a stigma, a tag. I'm gonna say, okay, is that family of mad people that you want to go and marry from? That is why you have to do everything you can to revive that boy. Let him restore his sanity. The day I the day the I challenge, oh, allow me to I apply this on your head. It's for your own good, though. As an enigma, as an enigma that I am. Yeah, never can do my job. Yeah, listen. If not for the sake of consignative factor, I would have sued you to court for sponsoring hearsay. And by the way, who told you that I? Mechike no nuwa. Who told you that I am not on Stay quiet. We go no wire. Ah. 
you are trying to wake the animal in me. You are trying to wake the animal in me. Do you know I can sue you for this? Do you know? Mama, what is going on? Uh, well, I'm trying to pray for rabbits. And what were you pouring on his head? I said I'm trying to pray for my son. something that is tormenting him. See, my life is torn apart. And I seem to be the only person in all of this. Udemba, he shall never be well with Udemba. He shall never be well with him. Mama, stop, stop. Believe me, my father Udemba that I know cannot hurt an act. Abosuniafa. Abosuniafa, remove that from your mind. Eh? All the effort have been making Trying to, to see that my brother's condition turns around. Lesionian. Even the psychiatrist recommend that we should take him home since the, the, the last syringe he pulled. Mama, um, from the look in my brother's eyes, he's not happy with himself. My spirit tells me that. It is not true. <laughs> Oh, true enemies are after my son. Ask your father this. Ask him very well. Go and ask your father well. Mama, can you stop? Can you just stop? The last time I discussed with my father, he did mention that Ichi Okonkwo is recommending a spiritualist that will take care of Nemeka's condition. And you're here calling his name, Mama, stop. I do not know the cause root of my son's insanity. But I don't intend to heighten it. Mama, Mama, what do you think? Give us an idea. We, we can't watch him and make her go down by the day. Eh? What do we do? Oh, I am tired. I am tired. I don't know what else to do. Big bro! Oh no, you are looking good. Ah, you are looking good. Ah, how are you? Uh, you came? Oh yes, I did. Wow. How are you? Mm, will I say I'm I'm good? Well, I'm good, but if not for your cousin brother and me, that we all have been trying our best to restore his sanity back, all to no avail. Huh? And another thing, eh? Do you know that your father has been accused on this particular issue? And everybody in this community knows about it. I don't know if you're aware. Ikenna. Ikenna, you still a child. So you believe all this rumor going around the village by my own father? Listen, my father cannot hurt a fly. I mean, how can people be doing all sorts of things they are not sure of? I'm just coming from Nemeka's house. To see him. Listen, tell whoever that is telling you that to shut up. Yes, tell him to shut up. Who, who in particular originated the whole rumors in the first place? If not to dog and her daughter. There are the people talking here and there. Your father did this, your father did that. Uh, of course, we know where the whole rumor is coming from. But that's not my problem. My main problem is how my brother will be well again. That's my interest. I don't care about all this nonsense they're talking about. Okay? Anyway, I'll see you in the evening, okay? Okay, of course, I'll come to the house. Good. Later good. in the day, I'll come. All right, be good, okay? Right, yeah.
na chile que na sopa de apio na maga na me copo your eyes open your eyes pico 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 what is it eh Give me come one for people know what did you see? Eh? Hey, come on, come on, come on! Let me come. We are all in our finals, and everyone is struggling and striving to graduate with good grades. And you're having carryovers in your department since last year. What happened? Talk to me. I have told you several times. My heart was broken. I lost everything. I lost... You lost everything? Your heart is broken? And uh, Chamaka told me what you said. That the devil lives in her father's house. Yes, because the devil lives in her father's house. A monster lives in her father's house. The Antichrist lives in her father's house. One who chattered my heart. Dashed my future. But I know with God on my side, with God on my side, I'll be fine. Girlfriend. I'll be fine. Girlfriend, talk to me so I can know how to help you. What about your boyfriend, Izuna? Are you guys still communicating? He left me. He... He broke up with me. He took his engagement drink and flew back to... Flew back to the States. I wouldn't have been able to graduate with you all this semester. If not for the money I saved. The little money I was able to save. And all this happened because I simply told, told him the truth. The truth about my encounter. I told him the truth about my life. And he decided to leave me. I thought they said when you say the truth, the truth will set you free. But no, my truth, my truth didn't set me free. It did not. And all this, all this happened because of that monster. Glory, he caught me. He caught me deep with his knife. And not just that he caught me with his knife, he did not just cut my flesh, he caught my scapula and had his way with me. And when he was done, he left me in my field. Oh my God, does your father know about this Antichrist? I didn't tell anyone. I have not told his soul. The only one who knows about this is God. The one who sees everything. Because he was there present. When this monster took advantage of a lone child. A child who's left with no one in, no one to take care of her. A child who made a promise to her sick mother on her dying bed. Well, at least you should
should have told the parish priest. I don't want to tell anyone who will talk to me about forgiveness. I don't, and I did not want to talk to anyone who would, who would tell me to forgive him. I hate that word forgiveness. And that is why I hate the portion of the Bible that says, forgive. They say God is all merciful. And when they do something, when they do something so horrible and terrible to their fellow human being, they come back to him and tell him to forgive them. And he just forgives and everything just goes like that. And that is why people don't take responsibility for what they do. So I decided to talk to no one. I didn't want to tell anyone that would talk to me about forgiveness. How could he do this to How could he do this to a lone child? How could he do this to someone who had no one to fight for him? And I have asked him several times, where were you when this was done to me? Because I don't understand why, why you were not there to defend me. I'm really sorry. I'm really sorry that you're going through all of this. I'm really sorry. Please put yourself together, okay? Please. I'm alright. No. You're not alright at all. You're not. Chiamaka, leave everything you're doing and come to Amanda's hostel immediately. Jima Amanda. Hello, Papa. I couldn't sleep last night because I know that you are troubled and you have refused to talk to your father. Please, tell me that which troubles you over this phone. Tell me. Papa, did the devil came. The devil came and struck. Papa, the devil came and attacked. Papa, no quarrel more. I don't quarrel more. Well, Papa, no quarrel more. Well, more. I did not do. I did not go looking for the devil. The devil came and I was on my own and he attacked and he won. I... And you are still crying, even in school. This devil, is it a human being or a lecturer? Tell 
me that that it troubles you. Papa, I did not talk to you because you are one of those who believe in forgiveness. You are one of those who believe in handling it the church way. And that is why people commit all form of atrocity and they get away with it because at the end of the day, you always say forgive because our God is all merciful. And that is why people do what they do and get away with it. So why would I tell you about what the devil did to me when you're going to end up telling me to forgive him and handle it the church way? I'm sorry for shouting at you, Papa. But I couldn't tell you because you would talk to me about forgiveness. <laughs> but don't worry, I... I'll come back soon and I'll tell you everything. I'm ready to talk. I am going to come back and tell you... everything. Everything the monster did to me. I am ready to talk. It's all right. When you come home, huh? Ah. Calm down, you'll be fine. Just calm down. Papa, the devil came and attacked. Papa, no quarrel more with. I no quarrel more with. I wasn't comfortable with the way she sounded. It is very obvious that she's hiding something from me. She. She talked to me. Is there any problem between Mama and my family? No, brother. It's just that since your father started to claim that portion of land and started having issue with my father and Nemeka, and now Nemeka's condition, my mother has decided to be avoiding some things. She, so you also believed that my father could hurt his own blood too? Chinonso, I'm not going to lie to you. This, my brother's condition has changed a lot about my mother. Her friend did America even took her to see a prophet. And the prophet gave her some prayers and directives. Though he told her to keep it as a secret. Please don't tell anybody you. Is that same prophet that has been giving her all these prophecies? I know. I am not surprised. Fake prophets. See, don't mind all those fraudulent men that parade themselves as man of God. This man has shared some homes apart. Happy as I go, so many family. Yes. Listen, your mother should not listen to them. Already I've told her. And you to go and unwake should not listen to them. They are fake. I, I know uh, those things I bought for my brother and America will be thrown away. But that's not my business. I'm here for us to talk about in America's condition. What do we do? Jamaka, I am sick and tired of Nemeka's condition. He's giving me sleepless nights. I don't like it. He's my brother and I care so much about him. Eh? And again, forget about Mama and her fake prophets. These people are fake. Eh? Honestly, she knows you can't go. go. I am tired. <laughs> Do you know the other day? Nemeka destroyed Pastor George's car windscreen. <laughs> You're not even understanding. Pastor George. Hey. 
Pastor George and what a one problem. One of the good pastors that we know that doesn't demand for money. Oh, Jesus. Ah, Nemeka. Nemeka. So that means uh, he's going to use his own money to replace his sports car. Yes, now. I need you to You don't have any money. But there's something Pastor George told me. He said that Nemeka is responsible for everything he's suffering. And since he told me that, I've, I've just been moot about this whole thing. I'm just nenezeam because I don't even know. I just said Pastor George is one of the good pastors that we know. Oh, goodness. I will send some money in your account. You will? Hey, thank you, brother. For your school <laughs> run and uh, for other things. Okay. Yeah. Thank you so much. God bless you. Huh? Oh, you're welcome. Jamaka, what do we do about the maker's condition? Because I'm tired. <gasps> Mr. Okoro! Hey, I have to go. This lecturer is, is somehow old. Okay, no problem. Bye-bye. Don't All forget right. to send your money. Oh, sure. I will, huh? Right. Let's see you, Mr. Okoro. Hey, that man. Hey, that man. Hi. Wow. Your nonchalant attitude towards serious issues is becoming too worrisome. I called you an hour ago and you're just coming. My brother Chino also came to see me. Would I have left him? At least you should have called to let me know that you're coming. <sighs> Sorry, ma. At least now I've given you the reason. So why the urgent call? Where was your late father buried when he died? Hmm? In my compound. Why the question? Because whatever is happening to Amanda has to do with your father's compound. She said a devil and an antichrist lives in your father's house. I mean, she said a lot about your house. But she has been coming over this short period of time. She keeps coming. She even came to help my mom give my sick brother food. So when did the antichrist start living in my house? And she never said this until her father came to my house to inquire the reason for her change in attitude. I have tried severely to snuff life out of the devil living in your father's house. But the devil keeps escaping. Chamaka, I lost everything, everything simply because we are friends. But my God will see me through. My God will see me through. Amanda. I don't understand this devil you're talking about. What are you saying? And this is not like the first time she's saying this. This is like the second time. Amanda is in pain. She's troubled. She was stabbed and wounded. Take a look. All from the devil in your father's compound. Could it be Johnson, my mom's sister's 
Swan, that ran out from our house. Amanda, is he the one you're referring to as the devil? Because he ran away from our house after he committed atrocity in the village. And the whole youth, they're after him. Wait, is he the one you're referring to as the devil? Because there is no way it will be my sick brother nor my mother. Pastor George, Peace good morning. Peace be unto you. Good morning. How are you? Hi. I'm actually on my way to your house to pray with you and your family. As you can see, there's nobody in the house and I'm rushing to see someone very important. Uh, it's only Nemeka that is locked in the house and Chiamaka has gone back to school. So, Biko, maybe some other time. I didn't see you in our last fellowship. What happened? Please, you will see me in subsequent ones. Uh, excuse me. I'm in a hurry. Biko. you need to know about me. I am like the science. The topic that couldn't be unraveled. This is just the tears of an iceberg. You will know who is who. You want to know who is mad? No way. It's impossible. Oh God. I will teach you a lesson. You will know who is mad in this house. How dare you forestall my peace out of your negligence and desperation? Impeccable desperation, impeccable, impeccable, impeccable desperation, impeccable, impeccable, impeccable desperation, impeccable, impeccable. Oh, one Kai. One and I saw Johnny Bo. Do you know that this pastor judge is not a serious man of God? Eh? Every day prayer and fasting. I've, I've almost developed also. My dear, don't mind that pastor. Mm. Eh? Hope you see what Prophet Dan was trying to point out. He stated categorically that Nemeka's predicament was engineered by friendly enemies. Oh, eh? We don't know who is who. You have to stand your ground and follow up the prophets. Hey, you know, today is the last day of the three days he gave to me mm -hmm. that he assured me that my son would be well. Huh? Udoka, you don't need to be agitated. Eh? He has never failed before. Mm -hmm. I trust him so much. Eh? He's a very good man of God. Just follow his directive and have faith on the oil. No problem. Hey. Uh, let's just watch and see. Eh? Well, I, I followed all his instructions. Mm -hmm. so I did Everything he asked me to do perfectly. Mm -hmm. eh? So let me run along. I left my son alone in the house. Come on, Nabo, maybe I'll meet him. Oh, the one who called it. Money. Hey! Hey! What have I done to deserve this? 
punishmental. Out of Karuma. How? You're going to punish. Anyone that decides to come against my peace shall have me to contend with. I deserve to be happy again. If not for the fact that the likes of Chukuman Zogu has the evil blood flowing through their veins on the north, we'd have used them all as pepper soup. I am. And I am. One eh, one eh, you know, you put a jar drama, one eh, not a puppy, but a child. Oh, I'm going to go to the car. You have killed me. What do I tell our women about their body? What do I say about their body? How do I explain this to them? Hey, Timo, what will I say? That another fake idiot has finished me. He gave me three days. Three days that all will be well. I see my son has done the worst. My son has done the worst. Oh. Hey, he enemy a kalonjo no. Who will I tell? I remember. Hey, 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 whoa. hey. I'm just a little bit more cool. Hey, Nemeka, you're just a Nemeka. Hey, come Babe, don't allow the pleasure of the house to weigh you down. This is the peak of our study here. In a couple of weeks, we'll be out here. Just cheer up. Cheer up. Focus on your exams, please. Please, my friend. Hmm? Ify, I'm just wondering what my mom is going through right now. We have been through a lot in our family. I'm just wondering where she will get 180,000 naira to repay the thrift. Where? How? I understand, my friend. Maybe you talk to Collins. Collins? Oh, please leave Collins out of this. Do you know what Collins has done for myself and my family? Hmm. Please, bro. I don't want to involve him. That guy has really tried. Do you want us to kill the poor boy? Mm. Boy, you can't claim that you love him and you hide this from him. Please, talk to him. Mm -mm. If he runs, then you will know your stand. Hmm? How long do you intend to play this hide and seek? Please, my friend, just talk to him. Well, I will just have to call my brother Chino so and tell him everything. I don't think Collins is an option here. Do you want to finish to enter a relationship? Well, mm. I've talked my own. Now. Let's rush to the auditorium. I don't want to drag it with anybody. I don't want. I don't have. It's to true. Care. Let's just Let's go. go. You don't know it's not good to be telling a man all the problems. I you understand. have seen your book. I understand, but you don't have. Any other choice now? Mm -hmm. I don't have any choice, but you can't be telling me man everything. Didiamaka, how could you do this to me? You told me that that man uh, was assistant to Jesus. I never knew I was signing up for the worst. I should have listened to my daughter, Chiamaka. Udoka, what are you talking about? Just come down and talk to me. How is he Nemeka? How is he doing? What do you mean, how is he Nemeka? Nemeka has just done the worst. Before I came home yesterday, he has already bought some of my things. Eh? Including the market to make thrift money. And before I could know what happened, somebody, I don't know what happened. The money is gone. What do you want me to do? And you are asking me to calm down. How do you want me to feel? Udoka, please calm down and talk to me now. Eh? Don't, you don't need to blame me for all this. Eh? I was just trying to help as a consigned friend. Did you keep your help to yourself? I don't want. I should have known better. Udoka. Udoka. Udobeke, wait. Udo. Ah, what have I done? I was just trying to help you. Brother Chino is such a lifesaver. Do you know he sent Mama the whole money? 
can even send a psychiatrist hey. to be administering drugs for my brother Nemeka. Oh, what a good news. I'm happy Honestly, for you. I didn't even know he would do such after such confrontation he had with my mother. I understand. That is meant for you. They are born with large hearts. And though not all, all of them, but they can care for one another unconditionally. My sister, you need to see the way my mother was even talking on the phone. She seems so relieved and happy. Mm -hmm. At least now I can concentrate on my studies. Mm -hmm. I'm happy for you. <laughs> Thank you. Mm, I know now. Don't need to ask your colleagues again. Because I know you did not bother telling him again. We have an hour to the exam. Read your books. I know. I know. Ah. Mm. See, you know, if that man should ask you to define this thing, there's no how you start writing all these things. All he needs is just the point. Yeah. I don't think that man doing his points. That's how exactly. he feels. Yeah. Exactly. He likes to twist his face too. So I think we should understand this side first. In case yes. they will ask you, it's only this place you yeah. But if you start writing this whole thing, that man okay. will just give you zero. Yes. Yeah, I'm going to check the way she oh, just appeared like speed. You guys are still ready. Mm. When the exam is about to start in five seconds. Last minute jacket. <laughs> I hope you didn't carry it for. You know I'm smart. Ah, of course I know. Anyway, um, Chamaka, I came to tell you to please wait for me after your exams. I want to see you. Okay. Please. Hmm? No problem. Anyway, I wish you girls um, success in your remaining papers. Good luck. Thank you. Bye-bye. See you later. <laughs> Hmm. Babe, she looks so cheerful this morning. She's very happy. I'm happy for her. But I'm here to understand that her statement that an antichrist lives in my father's house. Chiamaka, today is our final exam. Don't spoil it. Please don't spoil today for us. Just read your this thing. Read, we have exams. Okonkwo, Chinu Nsu, my son, was kind enough to send her all the money. Hmm? He said it's around 180,000 naira. You don't mean it? He even hired another psychiatrist to be administering injection to him from time to time. Hey. I said, Father, I have every right to stop him from doing that. But I did not. Yet, the woman is seeing me as the one who is holding her son captive. Hmm? Ah, forget her. You see, I'm very, very happy for your son. Your son has proven to be a man. A big man. Hey! But has um, Udoka contacted you? For where? Eh? How can she contact me? Am I not the evil man? Eh? I'm glad we did not make that move to see that native doctor as you suggested. I have washed my hands as Pilate did. But it won't stop my son from rendering help to the family. Maz, you day, I've been thinking. Hmm. I've been thinking what could have caused this mental illness to this boy. Or does he take banner secretly? Uh -huh. eh? Or there's this one they call uh, SK. Loud. Or even colos. Huh? Because I don't understand this one. I don't understand it. I don't know all these things. Rather, I normally see them on social media. And police people don't spare those people living on drugs. But they don't. Huh? They don't. Our boys are finished too. 
Our boys are finished. In my own opinion, I think that boy takes banner. He takes one of these things secretly. He does it. But that will not be the cause of that madness. Though. What must have caused his madness is far deeper than what we think. It's far deeper than what we think. That's exactly what I'm saying. Hmm. But Amanda is intelligent and she knows what she's saying about your family. Is she mad or what? Just calm down and let her speak up. Wait, 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 Ify. Are you trying to tell me that if you have a friend who is accusing you of having a devil in your father's house, you will clap for her? No, I will not. But remember, you told me a pastor said that your brother is suffering from what he committed. Have you thought about it? As long as I know Amanda and Nemeka, they don't have any business. Wait, wait, wait. What are you people even saying? Ify, did you forget? When my brother was in this school, didn't you see the kind of babes he was rolling with? Didn't you see? See, Amanda should be very careful. And mind her words against my family. When she was even coming to my house, it was not Johnson she, she was always talking to. But still, Johnson lived in your house before he ran away. That means a devil lives in your compound. And we need to let her speak up and tell us who the devil is. I cannot have my brother's mental illness bothering me. And then I will add Amanda's wahala to it. No! What is even wrong with you people? All of you should leave me alone. Let me be. Leave me alone. Are you mad at me? Because I'm trying to find out why our friend is in a state of confusion. What is all this now? Babe, I beg, calm down. I, I, you people should just leave I beg me alone. You. What is it? Calm down. Chi, I, I don't know how best to put this, but I, I really, I just really hope you'll understand. Well, uh, say whatever it is you want to say. After all, my family and I, we've been going through a lot and I'm still walking around. What is it? Say it. Okay. Uh, um, the thing is, I I don't know how my my uncle and my kinsmen managed to, you know, trace it to your place. They went to make inquiry the moment I told them about my my intentions to get married to you. So they somehow they, f they found out that your brother is mad, and since then I've been I've been waging series of war from my people. It's not been easy for me. It's not been easy for me. I don't understand. Um, can you can you repeat what you just said? Okay. Uh, <clears throat> uh, chi, chi, the thing is, I, you know, it's customary in our place to make inquiries about the families we are getting married into, right? You know about that, right? So I, the moment I told my people about you, they, they had to ask questions, you know? So they, they, they went to your place and somehow they found out about your brother's you know, mental ill health, found out he was mad and my family has been agitating against it, you know, against, against us. And oh, maybe ordinarily, I, I love you so much. You've come a long way, but I'm sorry. I, I ordinarily I don't, or I, rather I can't see myself ending up with someone that you know who hails from a family that has traits of madness. I kind of, I, I, especially my mom, especially I don't know. My mom can't see her but it's not easy from from my own side. It's not easy. 
you know, you can't see from my frame of reference, but I want you to understand what I'm. Oh, yes. I knew it. Sorry. I knew it. I knew a day like this would come, and now it has. I do not have any trace of madness from my father nor my mother. Madness is not in our lineage. Collins, I told you when this whole thing started. I told you. I told you my dad and my uncle got into this land dispute. And my brother put himself, and after that, that's how he went mad. Collins, you know that my family, you know everything we've done to restore my brother. Yet you stand here and tell me this, Collins. It's fine. It's fine. I don't even... I don't blame your mother. It's not her fault. It's not her fault, Collins. Thank you, Collins. Thank you for everything. Thank you. Thank you for everything. Thank you. Just leave like me alone. I shouldn't have voiced it out, but there's no other way to say it. I, I'm sorry. <laughs> Babe, calm down. Sorry. Stop crying now. Stop. It's okay. Just stop crying. It seems this your calling is mad. How can he just come to the school and start saying rubbish? Just calm down. Stop crying now. Stop crying. After all, Naim lose you. Naim lose you. They're your finals. Let's let him just go and marry whoever the mother wants him to marry. Just calm down. I don't want to see you crying like this now. <coughs> hmm? Just stop. <coughs> stop. Mama, good afternoon. <laughs> Pastor George? Mama, that, that will be next week after my exams. Okay, Mama, bye. What's happened? You just go to the hospital. Hey. Oh, this is all this now. It's okay, stop crying. Hello, Chamaka. What is it? Didn't I ask you to see me? But you didn't take it serious. Uh, uh, listen, listen, I'm not interested in your excuses. It's not necessary. Don't worry. It's okay. It's, it's okay. Chamaka, please, I'm reading later. Later we'll talk. Bye. Amanda, 
What is wrong with you? See, we have been best friends right from the village. And if there is anyone who is supposed to know anything about you, it's me. And the worst is, you wouldn't even tell me anything anymore. Okay, see, if not for glory, I wouldn't even know your fiancé who proposed marriage to you has left. Amanda, what is happening? Who stabbed you? Chamaka, if you wanted to know answers to these questions, you should have come when I asked you to come. If you expect me to tell you story of my life now, which I don't want to talk about because it brings so much tears to my eyes. And to tell you the truth, Chamaka, I have cried enough. I don't want to cry anymore. Okay, please, can you at least tell me the reason you sent for me? It's past. If you wanted to know why I called you, then you should have answered when I did. I am not in the mood to talk about anything now. But the most important thing you should know about is the devil dwells in your father's compound. Johnson has left. He has left the entire village. Amanda, please tell me, why did he stab you? Or what even led to him stabbing you? I know how his anger can be. I know him too well. Please just tell me what happened, please. Your mom, your mother called me um, earlier today. She said Pastor George wants to see me. Do you know why he wants to see me? Did anything happen? Pastor George is, is a man of God. Maybe he saw something for you. And even me as well, because he requested I come back as well. Really? Good afternoon. Hey. You're welcome. Oh, Mama Maka. Uh, yes, yeah, so it's like you are planning to cook. Yes, yeah, so I want to cook a goose. So, ah! so yeah. bring that your voice. Your brother is sleeping at the back of the house so that you don't wake him up. Okay. okay. No problem, Mama. Let me take my bag hey, inside. You're welcome. No yeah. more. Hey, how is school? Mama, school is fine. No. Yeah, hey. Let me hold ah. it so that I make it. Pastor is here too. <laughs> oh, Pastor. Pastor, good afternoon. Good afternoon to you. You're welcome. How are you? Fine. And now, Pastor, oh. welcome. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Now. It seems you're just coming back. Yes, Pastor. It's okay. Pastor, please sit. We have sit. Oh. Okay, Mama. No lie. It's okay. okay. Pastor, let me take my uh, Before you go, Chamaka, do you have any other friend? I mean, a close friend, apart from Amanda. Because... Each time I pray, her face kept appearing. Though I don't know her that much, but Mama told me she may be one. But, Pastor, you know Chimamanda now. I brought her to your church when she said she was having nightmares. Though she is Catholic. Imania. Oh, 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 I remember. No, I remember. No, from what I saw. She had something in connection to the maker's mental health. Yes? Yes. I asked Mama here to call her. To, I mean, ask her some questions because 
She has a role to play. Yes. Amanda. Yes. Pastor. Pastor, you are right. She told me that a devil lives in this house. A devil? Devil. And she cries each time she says that. And her laps was stabbed. But she wouldn't even explain the whole thing to me. Mama. Mm -hmm. And I was here thinking it was your sister's son, Johnson. How? Amanda, where more? Hey, hey. Please, uh, let's, let's wait for Amanda to come back. Eh? Let's wait for her to come back so that we'll ask her. Let's know exactly what is going on because right now I'm confused. I don't even know which, which one to believe. Now, Pastor, you said uh, uh, you saw her in your vision. My, my vision, yes. Eh? Yes, ma'am. What do you want to do? talking about sin. If you ask me to use sin as a phrase, I'll tell you sin is believing. There are two cardinal points of sin. As you see the ego and ego sees you, that is an example of a phrase. Oh, and when Gaza took their war to Israel, what were they thinking? What was in their medulla oblongata? <laughs> Nemeka. Hey. Pastor, if it's convenient for you, can we speak English language? Hey. Abu Nemeka. 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 Amanda Nemeka. 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 Allah. What would have been the problem between your brother and Amanda? Do you know I've not been myself since the pastor said what he said? Eh? I was even looking down on that pastor. I never knew that God had been using him mightily. Mm. Mama, you can say that again. Because for him to see vision about Amanda and Nemeka, it really means he saw something wrong. But the big question is, can Amanda tell us exactly what happened? Because it seems like she's hiding something. Hey! Oh, oh. What do I do now? Eh? Do I go to her father and, and tell him to, to, to ask her, let him force her to speak? At least we'll know what the problem is. Oh. Eh? Amanda is not a bad girl. Eh? What must have been the problem? There's, there's a problem somewhere. Mama, if you ask me, for the pastor to have revealed this, the problem is half solved. Let's just wait for Amanda to come. Inugo? Hey! How do I face How do I face Udemba and his wife Ungozi? Hey! Another problem. If, if it's happened that they have no connection in what is happening, how do I face them? What will I say? Kedi he Ha! Mama Uzubu, please. See, you need to take everything easy before your BP escalates. So. And we'll start saying another thing. Biko, can you hear Mama Biko? Oh? Hey, oh.
it is better I tell my father what happened to me than tell anyone else first. He has asked me for a number of times, but I have refused to tell him. But I think it is time I open up my wound. It is time I show him my wound. My life has been tortured. My heart stopped. I told Izuna the truth of what happened to me. I told him everything. The only one whom I opened up to. He did not believe me. Yet he dumped me. Because he thought I was lying to him all this while. He thought that when I told him I was a virgin and that I wanted to wait until our wedding night that I was telling nothing but a lie. So he dumped me. He stabbed me. Stabbed me to gain access to And destroyed me. He took away my dignity. He took away everything. I am not even done with him. I'm just getting started. I hold nothing against him. I just wanted to let her be. So she accused me of being responsible of what is happening to her son. Nimeka is my elder brother's son. That makes me also my own son. How can I think of such evil? No, I can't do that. Nata, ensure you support and pray for your mother too. Everyone in this community knows what she's been through in the past few years. It's not been easy with her, and we understand that. If the pastor says Nemeka brought upon himself what he is passing through, well, we shall know what he did. Okay? Papa, my daughter, please forgive us. My daughter, do I look like somebody who has something in mind? No. What I pray every day is for the Almighty God to keep me alive yeah. until I see who is responsible for my elder brother's son mentality. Yeah. And I'm sure we are close to that. Yeah. We are close to that. Um, Ada, who is this Amanda you've talked about? Akukwe's daughter. Ah, uh, your friend. Yes, ma'am. Hi. Hey. What must have happened between them? Hmm. Hi. Good afternoon, my daughter. Papa, I... I came back because I am ready to tell you what happened. Ah. All right, let me sit down and hear you. Mm. Now that you have made up your mind, to talk to your father about what happened. I am your father, though your mother is dead. But I have been here for you. Whosoever that is responsible for all your wasted tears, God knows, I won't spare that person. 
whether man or woman. <laughs> Chamaka and I have always been friends. Yes. And I have always gone to their house. And her, mine. Yes. Every time we come back from school, and I go to their house. Nimika will always be all over me. And constantly I have told him that I am not interested. Constantly I have rejected his advances towards me. Yet he will not stop. Oh, you see, um, I've been meaning to ask you this. Why is it that when I call you in the school, you, you ignore me most times? When I call you, you don't even answer. That is because I keep repeating myself. Nemeka, I have told you several times, I am not interested. Eh, just, just let me be. You, and you keep disturbing me. Besides, you have a lot of girls in school who are at your beck and call. Why don't you focus your energy on them and, and, and just leave me alone? Hey, why are you even sounding the way you're sounding? Those girls are just my friends and nothing more. Well, I don't care who they are to you. Whether friends or fools, it's none of my business. My own is just let me be. I came to that school to study and learn. And that is exactly what I would do. So if you think I'm going to let myself lose and let any of you boys in that school to toy with me, then you're dreaming. Well, I came to you, see, you, see, you see this thing you're doing, eh? Let me tell you. One day, one day, I'll end up seeing your pants. Don't worry. I'll see the color, the true color of your panties. I'll tell you. Nemeka, you will see whose pants. I'll see your pants. Don't in worry. your wildest dream. Nemeka, see, let me tell you, a million of you can never. What kind of nonsense talk is that? You will see whose pants. In your dream, in fact, in the next world you will come, you cannot even dare. A million of you cannot. What kind of nonsense talk is that? Did you say what? Did I say what? I said a million of you cannot. That a million of I, Nemeka, cannot. Do you know I am a man? Do you want to try the capacity of a man? Oh, you see who is talking of capacity? A man. A man, a, man, a, man, a man that wants to see a woman's pants by force. So when they talk of men with capacity, you will come out. Nemeka, you have no capacity. You have zero capacity. As a matter of fact, you're owing capacity. Minus 99. You're still owing them. You, 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 want to see, you want to see my pants. See, let me tell you, pass the message to your cohorts. Those, those riffraffs in school, they can never... In their life, life to come, see my pants, because I did not come to school to sleep with any man. I will go to that school and I will come out and uh, uh, until I get married, that's the only time anybody will see my panties. And that will be my husband. You, you, you want to see my pants? Don't even bother. Don't even try, because it can never happen. Not in this world, not in another world. It seems Chiamaka is not even at home. That didn't stop him. Rather, he persisted. He went as far as going to school to tell everyone that I am his girlfriend. But I just waved it off. I am not interested in knowing what happened in the school. What I want to know is what makes you cry every time you return home. Papa, I want to take it one after the other. Ah, go ahead, my daughter. I'm listening. I don't want to jump any hoop. Okay. So that you understand what exactly happened. And not what I'm away. Papa, am I a troublesome person? 
No, really, do you do you see me as someone who who who, who trespasses? Your father is listening. Just tell me what happened. I know you are not a troublesome person. One of those days I came back from school. On my way going to somewhere. Nemeka blocked me on the way. And as usual. So, you've been going around telling people in the school that I cannot get you, right? You've been telling people in the school. Look at everybody that looking at me somehow. Nemeka, that is because you go around telling people I am your girlfriend. When I am not. How can you be going around spoiling my name now? Do you know my boyfriend passed from this school before he, 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 he traveled out? And he was once the SUG president of our school. So everything that is happening in school, they still report back to him. You go around spoiling my name. You think I find it funny? Listen, let me tell you something. Because I'm your, 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 your sister's friend and then we're from the same community, does not give you the right to spoil my name. You should learn to respect yourself. So, 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 don't stop it. I don't like it. Amanda, so you're, you're warning me. I am not warning you. Amanda, you're warning me in there. Make me. I am not warning you. I am only telling you to please right. desist from what you're doing. Okay. It is wrong. Stop spoiling my name. Respect yourself now. So you are still indirectly telling me that I cannot get you. That's what you mean. That I cannot get you. Nemeka. Ah, Nemeka. You can never get me. Not in your life. Not in any life. Not in this present life or in the next one you're going to come. I stopped going to their house. Even when Chamaka and her mother asked why I stopped coming. I only told Chiamaka. I warned her. I told her to tell her brother to desist from pestering my life. To stop disturbing me. But she didn't take it serious. She just laughed it off. I didn't go there for a long time. I avoided going there until I needed my shoes back. The shoe Chiamaka borrowed from me to attend the wedding. And I wanted the shoe. So I had to go and collect it from her. And on that fateful day, I went there. And that was when it happened. Uh, uh, Amanda, how are you? I'm fine. And you? I'm okay. Oh. Please, is Chiamaka at home? Uh, Chiamaka should be sleeping inside. Well, Amanda, it's been a long time I saw you here. Why haven't you been coming around? Are you quarreling with anyone? Uh, no, just that I've been very busy with school and every other thing. Oh, okay. Uh, please, can you, can you help me wake her up from sleep, please? Uh, uh... Amanda, you can go in and wake her up yourself. Can't you see that I'm busy? Go in there and do it yourself. Sorry for disturbing. No, it's okay. Take your time. She was sleeping. She am Today is going to be a good day for you and I. Mimika, what are you doing? Listen, it is better you cooperate. Mimika. If you want it to be the bad way, it's on you. Mimika, come down, come. You said a million of I in America cannot I'm... have you. Mimika, that was what Mimika, you said. Mimika, you dare to go out. You dare to go out. You dare to go out. You want to dare a cousin with me?
I didn't wrong him in any way. The only wrong I did was going there to collect my shoe. Then he stabbed me. Huh? He caught my scapular. Mm. He tore my clothes and had his way with me. Hey! <laughs> but I, did, I didn't do anything. I didn't wrong give it anyway. I did not do anything. I didn't do anything. If I had a brother who could defend me. If I had a brother, he would have defended me. But there was no one. I don't want to defend me. <laughs> Papa, I didn't do anything. Oh, Papa, is it my fault? <sighs> it, it, maybe I did something wrong. Maybe it's my fault. Is it my fault? From everything I have told you, do you think it's my fault? <laughs> Don't worry, don't, don't worry, I'm coming right away. Papa, Papa, hold on, I am not done telling you everything. No, no, sit down, sit down, I'll, I'll be with you. Stop, sit down. Just going to your house. You mean here? Yeah? Thank God I met you here. Okonkwa. Are you going to? Okonkwa. Ngugu. I got to get to get. I don't have money to ambo. Be in your way. Huh? I don't understand this one. Can you please follow me to my house? I hear with your two ears. Akukwe. You, you know I'm taking BP medicine. I, 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 I don't want something that will give me BP. Oh. But my problem cannot be giving you BP. Okay. But, hmm? Okay. Mm, let, let's go. All right, let's go. Let's go. I hope all is well. Have you ever heard that my daughter Amanda is having an issue with anybody in this community? Wait, calm down. Calm down. Calm down. You said I should follow you to your house, that you have something that you want me to hear. What is it? Calm down and tell me now. Nemeka, Nemeka raped my daughter and stabbed her. Eh? Wait, which Nemeka are you talking about? Udoka's son, of course. But now, that is not possible now. How can Udoka's son, Nemeka, who is raving mad, rape your daughter? But now, it's not possible. Eh? Only top of the inner chain. Who removed these chains? Does he even know what a woman is in situation? Eh? Can a madman have an erection? I want to understand. You said they stabbed you. Please show me where they stabbed you. I want to see it with my eyes. Show me. No, no, no. Let's, let's see it. Let me see. Mm. Ah. 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 
It is what he did that is responsible for his madness. How? After he raped and stabbed me, I went straight to Mgeni Shrine. <laughs> I went straight to Mgeni Shrine to report him. I didn't want to talk to anyone else because I didn't want anyone telling me anything about forgiveness. All I wanted at that moment was revenge. And I went to the place, the only place I knew I was going to get revenge, which was in Gene Shrine. Hey! 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 <laughs> Young lady, what is it? I was raped, and stabbed, and hurt by a man I did nothing to. You said you did nothing to him. I did nothing to him. This is a man I... I considered a brother. I only went to their house to collect my shoe that I gave to the sister. I didn't know the sister was not at home. Then he took advantage of me. He stabbed me. He tore my clothes. He tore my pants. And, and he caught my scapular. Then he raped me. Wipe your tears, young lady. Ngane will fight for you as far as your hands are clean. My hands are clean. Away him, Miriam, come with your child. I know what I'm on him. I know what I'm on him. Drop the clothes, bring it here. And everything, Jungle, and tell the Almighty Ngene what you want. Go and sit down. 
Oru kwa nuko neru o. O tuonye na bara. Omo ya po. Akwa nunda bugada buruma takrea. Omo ya go me. Fight for her. The Almighty in Ghana. Fight for her. <laughs> Whatever a man sows, he shall reap. Go and never look for trouble. Ngene will arise for your sake. Stand up and go. Thank you, Izemo. Thank you. Thank you. Hey! So Ngeneka was the cause of all this mess. Eh? See what he did to an innocent child. Ha! And his mother has been going around accusing Udemba for nothing. For nothing. No, no, bam, 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 bam. This is this is serious. But why Ngene? Amanda, I've always known you to be a devoted child of God. Why did you choose the option of going to Ngene instead of the church? Why? Because the church will ask me to forgive him. But Ngene will not. Hmm. And you also did not talk to your father. <gasps> because, Papa, you would have brought the parish priest to cancel me. And then he would ask me to forgive him. When all I wanted was revenge. I wanted him to pay for what he did. Hey! No. No. <gasps> Welcome. Thank you. Thank you, Yugi Mama? She's fine. What's up, you now? You can come inside. Mama! You're welcome, my team. Uh, thank you, Mama. Uh, first and foremost, I want to apologize for coming late. Uh, it wasn't intended. I had other commitments, so I had to run around before coming down here. I'm sorry. It's okay. Uh, I had wanted to see you to explain to you about my family and what happened to my son. Uh, due to the fact that uh, you said that your family found out about my son's mental illness and then that the marriage proposal has been cancelled. Mm. Mama, um, the point is, I don't, you know, when it comes to tradition, you know the implication of these things, you know, and I, well, on my own, I'll, I'll try convincing them again. I'll try to persuade them, and if they accept, fine, because I, for one, know that I love your daughter so much. I love her so much. I mean, seeing her through school to this point. Uh, it's not easy giving up on her. Uh, notwithstanding, I can't shy away from the fact that I don't want to share or start a foundation with a family that has traits of madness in their lineage. And, you know, these things can be generational, and then as time goes on, it transits from one generation to the other. So that's my fear, that's my worry. 
not like I. It's difficult on my own part, man. No, I go to where the pool more, mama. Go. I I understand what you're trying to say, but this family does not have such. Yeah, th there's no madness in this family. It doesn't run in our blood. Okay, I am a woman, and someone married me into this family. You know, my my family asked questions too. So it's a normal thing. There's nothing wrong in your family asking questions and for us to tell you exactly what is happening to the family. We, we don't have trees of madness in this family. <sighs> They're not mad. And it's in Ulike, but then Mama, I need to... I, I, if I must ask, what... What led to this state? What, what, what... Why did he run mad? What happened? I, I, I don't know. But I, I'm still yet to find out. Uh, he, the pastor said that he's the architect of his own misfortune, but we're still working to find out what is the problem exactly. We'll find out the cause. Oh, nah. Please. No, tell me. Do you understand the meaning of sorry? The adjective for sorry is sorry. The comparative adjective for sorry is sorry. The superlative adjective for sorry is sorriest. So I cannot take sorry for your work. This is the problem of this Nemeka. I cannot condescend into any act of disregard from any of you. You know why? I know my honors and I know how to exercise my authority. Let the parliament begin. Oyibo. Ha. Okay. Stop! Stop! What is wrong with you? Carry your car. Start going. Just start going. Hey! Start going. Carry your car. Collins, please don't drive. Stop! 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 You have space, let's speak English. Space. I have space. Biakai is all your boy, Bobby. I can't Hey! My friend, my friend, my friend, my friend. Do you know that if you can use it? I was in Ibeka's house yesterday. And Nemeka is nothing to write home about. He's still there. He's still there. We shouldn't give up on him. In fact, I came back to see one man like that. He said he's the best in handling mad people in this state. Yes. So anything it will cost, I will handle it. Oh, my mom. <laughs> I said it. Hey! I said it. <laughs> my son, I said it. I said it. He memorized your book. I can't sort in here. I know that a day like this will come. Hey! Papa, what is it? My son. The story I had today have vindicated me from Udoka and all her accusations. I know that a day like this will come. Hey! Hey! Eh? Yeah, Papa, I am confused. What are you saying? What story are you talking about? Talk to us. My son. Talk to us. Nemeka raped Amanda. Hey! Akupa's daughter. The helpless girl ran to Ngene and madness struck. Ew! Hey. Wonder shall never end. <laughs> I give thanks to the Almighty God who has proved me right. Hey, my son. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. Now I remember Nemeka shouting to something I could not. 
See? <laughs> Raped Amanda? Oh. How? When? May the gods be praised. Hey! Mm -hmm. Amanda should have told me what transpired between her and my brother. But she didn't. Eh? She came to see me and Nemeka raped her. Hey, she would have at least told me before, before taking this dangerous step. What did too much? Hey. Rape is rape. Whether she told you or not. But the question here is, why would he do such a thing to that girl? Did he smoke something? Hmm. Just look at what, what, what we've, we've been passing through here. I wonder how someone you see as gentle and calm will end up doing the unimaginable. Now, Ngele is involved. How do he get back his senses? Got in Enuma, Enuma, Shibe, Wama. Let me go and skip me. Eh, I'm a dead man. I'm still in my bed. She said he's your man, but look at what she did to me. Hey, Shibe, the pastor said it. The pastor judge said it. Eh? He's the only one that said exactly that my son was one that committed what he's suffering today. They say, no. Yeah, but I go and go pastor judge. I keep up pastor judge. Mama, we we'll call him. Oh, I cannot go judge. I can't go no. Hey. I'm telling you all of you, I will shoot. In 1986, a letter bomb was sent to the office of a renowned, a revered journalist of a great nation. And after that bomb exploded and killed the journalists, those who carried out the acts, how is their life today? And how is their family? If only they knew that standing with the truth would make the nation move forward, they wouldn't have done that. And I ask again, when I was supposed to say so, Ibu. The Ibu chance, let's speak English language. You're looking at me. Hey. When I was supposed to say so, Ibu. Hey! I cannot call you. I don't know what he says. I don't understand what he's saying. I don't understand what he's saying. Hey! Amanda, what are you telling me? So you hid this from us, your friends? Why? A man raped you and you couldn't speak out. And you know the school anti-court is here to handle him well. And you know my brother is the head of the anti-court. Amanda. Afterwards, they will let him go free. After all, they are all friends. Not in this case. They will hand him over to the police. And after some time, the police will let him go, as usual. This is exactly what happens on this side of the world. Pedophiles, rapists, they, they, they take advantage of women, rape them, tear them in and out. And they don't take responsibility for what they did. And you didn't have any other means than going to Ngene Shirai. A devoted Christian like you, Amanda, how did you even step your feet in this shrine? Mama, don't tell me about being a Christian. You want me to report it to the parish priest, right? 
report it to the parish priest and he calls the both of us and try to make peace and then asks me to forgive him. And that is it. He walks away free. Tomorrow he looks for a net, his next victim. Well, I will not let it go that way. I didn't want anybody telling me anything about forgiveness, telling me anything about letting it be. I wanted him to pay for what he did and he got the punishment and not enough. Because I'm not done with him. So that men will, like him will never try it with any other girl. Just calm down. So, Nemeka raped you and even stabbed you. Why? You should ask him why. Nemeka. Nemeka, you raped a woman. Eh? Look at your life now. So, upon all the money your late father and I spent to send you to school, this is what you use in paying us back by raping Amanda, an innocent girl who did nothing to you. Just imagine how miserable your life is now. Look at it. That I am not mad because this whole thing is as a result of the quagmire, or this whole quagmire is as a result of sheer negligence. I am telling you because if what is perceived as hearsay. Might be the answer. Oh, you know, I'm not even a bottle, I'm not even a bottle, I'm not even a bottle. He can't get out, he can't get out of the cha 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 cha. Rapist, the cow. I don't want you with a ban in your phone. Oh, you rape one in all there. So careful. That is a language, a derogatory language that was spoken by a man in Philadelphia. I want to be the shaker as a human being, Munya Gabu five and six. If they can give me pen and paper, I can tell them this. In as much as I love my brother and the family, I will not allow anybody from my family to go and peace, to go and appease any ghost or shrine or whatever you call it. Nemeka is so stupid to commit such an abomination. Let them solve it by themselves. Papa, should we fold our hands? Thank God the cause of the problem has been exposed. Is your papa gave And I got up with you. Let's help that young man. Look, maybe you have forgotten. My father gave back to me in a Christian faith. And since I grew up, I've never seen my father or my mother go to any shrine or deity. Even my brother, Okafo, never did. Are you supposed not to ask me such stupid question? I will cease to be my son if you step your foot to that Ngane shrine. Your father has said it. And that is where I belong. Nemeka is your cousin, uh -huh, I know. But you have to allow the family to handle this. Ngele shrine is not a small shrine at all. There might be sacrifices involved, which our faith don't pair with. Papa, 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 Mama. In as much as I condemn what my brother did in totality, that boy has suffered. Uh -huh. Listen, 
if going to Ngeni Shrine will make Nemeka to be fine again, why not? As far as we're not going there to do any devilish sacrifice. Besides, the girl in question should first give a nod. This boy is trying me. Chino, so you are trying me. I am your father and has spoken. And so shall it be. If you try make a step to that in Guinness shrine, I will publicly disown you. Try it. I will slap you. Nonsense. It's, it's, better, it's better you slap me. It's better you slap me. You can do anything you want to. Yes, I must help my brother. He's my brother. This is very delicate to see. At least I saw it. I knew that something was wrong. But she went too far. By reporting to the shrine. When she said they would take Catholic. I mean, the reference are there. They should have solved this problem their own way. But Nemeka, Nemeka did not try at all. Have any of you gone to see her? I mean, to her peace, to her mind and soul. I was there yesterday, Pastor. I was there. I, I, I tried talking to her, but she, she didn't even want to see me. Eh? And I... I, I I went to speak with her father. Her father also did not want to talk to me. I don't know. I just left. Hmm. I don't know what else to do. Chiamaka. Pastor. She's your friend. Go and see her. Talk to her woman to woman. If it fails, then let me come in. Okay. Pastor, she didn't tell me this in school. I don't even know if she's going to listen to me. Rape is a very bad thing in the society. And the trauma is something else. Whatever that girl did, nobody should blame her. We must take things easy with her. Until we get her mind. Papa, good morning, sir. Good morning, sir. Papa. Papa, please. Let's, let's handle this issue calmly. Eh? Papa, please, can I see my friend Amanda? At least I can talk to her like a friend. Papa. What am I hearing? What you heard is true. Hmm? Since the girl in question and her father do not even want to see us, at least let him just see us and, and tell us what to do. He has refused. 
He, he doesn't want to pay attention to us. Cha, cha, cha. Hey, I was just coming from their house. And the father, he, he's just sitting there. He couldn't even answer my greeting, let alone talk to me. <laughs> See, I know what my brother did. What he did was not good. But are we going to allow him to remain like that for life? Mama, we found out what exactly happened. What are we going to do? Call a sin by its name. The old man is bitter. Very angry. He don't know God, but they, eh? Who will be having fun when such crime is committed on his own child? What my brother did is wrong. Very, very bad. Even my father said that he's not going to be part of his because of things involved. Most Christians do not go to the shrine. Then Amanda went for a revenge. But she thinks that that place is her last resort. Listen, all we should be thinking now is how to solve this problem. Yes. Honestly, I don't know how to stand before your father and beg for his forgiveness. It's because with the issue of this land, the lingering issue of the land, and my son's condition, everything got me so confused. I don't even know what to do. I was thinking it was the one behind my son's predicament. Eh? How do I stand before this man and beg for his forgiveness? He never can kill me. Never can make a man. No, 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 Nanya and Didi, I have a lot of stress on me right now. All I want you to do is to go and get my money for me. Eh? That, that your prophet, prophet Daniel or whatever you call him, is a thief, a big thief. and should not be allowed to remain in this domain. If not for my son's sickness, I would have gone there myself to collect my money. Can you do nonsense, Bianca? Udo Beke, eh? Prophet Dan is no longer in this town, no? Yes. He ran away after duping the Igwe second wife. Even the police are after him. Eh? I'm very sorry. I thought he was genuine as I was told. I never knew he was fake. Eh? Please, my sister. We all are trying to proffer a solution to Nemeka's predicament. Not knowing that he brought this upon himself. Eh? How can he commit such an abominable act now? Eh? Like I said earlier, I am stressed. I need to go home and then take off something to do. I'm out of me here now. Go. Oh. Let me just go home. Mm -hmm. Why are you them? <laughs> Why are you them? Mm. Find them. He did well. In fact, I'm looking for a way to bust out. Hmm? So I, I want to, to tell you this thing. Mm -hmm. So that you understand it. Whether you can understand it, the way I'm understanding it. Okay. okay. Uh -huh. In a same country, do you think that Nemeka will be still alive? The answer is Abida no. Mm. <laughs> yes. If you try this kind of a thing in India, I will not put the to work again more for my thunder will fire you left and right. Yes. See? Do you know if you go to Donna Masters or Zenith Hotel? You will see all these old women who have passed all this amendment postage. <laughs> yeah? They will come and be shaking their waist. They shake it again around because of many payment. Many payment! You will see men will come. They will pay. They will go inside. They will hang their trousers on the next spot. 
and climb up. Choco, 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 choco. Come here, come here, come here. Before 10 seconds, they don't fall. They will fall. <laughs> they will just jump out like a dog. <laughs> like a dog. Under 30 seconds. And you go Yes. And they will collect their money. If you go to 90 miles, if you go to Opie Weka, there are too much there. The only thing you need to do is if you go there, you pay them. You pay them. They will use they do your recording. You need you need you not you need you not before you know what will happen, you have already poured. <laughs> yes. What did this one they pay me? This one they pay me. I don't know how person when they're using medulla or blangata. Somebody that is using his cerebrum, someone that is having intestine, will come and rape a fine girl. A fine girl that I have already counted as one of my wives, one of my cucumber. Ah. Mm. Hey, hey, ah. Mm. Yeah. The other day, Ngele told me that Amanda told told, told him that uh, uh, Amanda should not have dared the man in him by telling him that uh, he, he, he should not see her underwear. And he went and took it by force, by force, by fire, by force, by fire. Ah, mwake, liver na kwa, dika na kwa See, let me tell you, I have a suggestion, one solid suggestion. You have to go and tell her that. You have to go to Igwe, Igwe's palace. Go and plead with Igwe. Let Igwe find a everlasting solution to these things. But I want to ask you, it's like I'm talking too much these days. I'm talking too much. Now let me go and take my family. Ha! My them. Ha! Oh, wow. This girl. Oh, this girl. Ha! Amanda, how are you? We have to see you. My name is Pastor George Amanda. We have to see you, Amanda. Hear us out. Don't turn your back on us, please. We know your heart had broken, but please, I beg you. God in heaven. God. Oh, Jesus. Arrest her soul. Arrest her by your mercy. We all know and had her and met my brother's son mad. Even you, Akokwe, accused me too of trying to kill my brother. 
and take over the whole of our land. But my only consolation is time will tell, which we have seen now. I am not in support of him. I don't like what he did. My family is not known for madness and rape. I don't know where Nemeka got this character from. I don't know. <sighs> anyway, what do we do to solve this problem? Hmm. Honestly, I heard fright from Amanda. Is it her tears? Is it her broken heart? Hey! Mm. All that she passed through, all because of this. Huh? That girl is a strong girl. If not, she wouldn't have even finished her school. I even heard that the man that was supposed to marry her left her because of all this. Ah! Oh. But, but we must find a way out. Akukwe, Biko, Biko Kanayo, plead with your daughter. Let her please forgive him. This boy we are talking about has suffered so much all because of this. His mental illness, he has suffered. Biko, now you are you. Hmm. Uh, I have nothing. I have nothing to say in this matter. Amanda is a grown up woman and has right to decide on this matter, not me. I can't even talk to her concerning the forgiveness you asked of uh, Nemeka. I can't. Nemeka did not only rape her, but use the knife and stab her lips. Huh? What if that knife got to her bone? Her bone! Eh? No, Will we be here talking this yati yati in the weather? Why you? Why you? Why Relax. Please, uh, calm down. I know how deep it thoughts. Please, relax. In a way, I know how deep mm? it hurts. You are a father. And I've seen the anger. Please, it's okay. Calm down. Eh? Uh, where is, uh, where is Amanda? She's inside. Mm. Can we see her? Can we see her? She cannot even see you people on this matter. Hey. You just have to mellow down mm? and let me talk to her in this matter. Oh, mm? Thank you so much. This one you have so said much. now has calmed my mind hey. down. Because just try and talk. Ah! If she forgives, we can now forge her head. You know, we could talk. Please. Okay, come on. My friend, you need to forgive him and set him free. He has been like this for four years. That's so. Oh, you feel four years is enough punishment for him? You think that makes up for what he did to me? I don't get it. This is how we go about forgiving people who are supposed to be paying for the evil they did. What exactly is wrong with Africa? Because we are so sentimental about everything. That is how we go about forgiving rap rap rapists, pedophiles. People who are supposed to be languishing in jails. And they keep on doing it over and over and over and over and over again. Leaving a lot of women and children traumatized with deep scars that can, nothing can erase. Just stop it. Stop it. Just relax. I understand you. 
I know what you are passing through. No, you my have friend. no idea. One single idea of what I am going through, Ifoma. You don't. Please don't tell me you understand it because if you do, you will not be here telling me this nonsense. No, really, why would you come to tell me this? I'm your friend. No, you're not my friend because if you're my friend, you will not be saying this. If you are my friend, you will not be here, seated here, telling me this nonsense. I just want you to let it go, please. I can see they bought you over. Please. No, I can clearly see they have bought you over <gasps> the same way they bought my father. I don't blame you. I know exactly what to do. <laughs> what do you want from me? Wise one, I greet you. Um, please, my cousin was reported here. And uh, since then, the young man has been mentally unstable. Please, we are here for a solution, please. Please. <laughs> I will not waste any of your time. That young man will remain like that until he dies. If the girl that reported him to the shrine did not come and plead with Ingele to forgive him, that young lady came here with a heavy heart and told Ingele what happened. And also told Ingele what to do. If that young girl did not come, Ingele will not leave him. Amanda, we have come to plead with your conscience to please allow this go. Let God judge him. Forgive him, please. Unlock him from the prison of your heart. Let him get his senses back. The Bible always admonishes us to forgive. Please forgive him. I beg you in the name of God, please forgive him. Amanda Wandam. I've known you as a decent girl in this village. The way you walk, talk, and do your things. In fact, Nkebe Zyoku is that I had wanted to come for your hand in marriage. But my sister here, Chiamaka, told me that you have someone very special to you and that you cannot trade him for millions in the world. Please, my brother Nemeka has done the worst evil on this earth. I, I hate to call it by its name. Please, Biko, we begin that true. The oracle said that it's only you that has the right to come to the shrine and undo what you did. Amanda Wamarama, Ego Ibo, because then we've been suffering. Nemeka's condition is very critical. Other is in Mokibala, not in the family. Please, please forgive and forget. Okay? Yeah? Please. Mama Rama. Please. 
Oh? <laughs> Madam, please. Oh? please. Just look at me. Look at me. Please. Please. Please sit. Thank you. Just like the pastor said, forgiveness is all that matters. Who am I not to forgive him? For if our Heavenly Father can forgive us of all our sins, but I will take solace on the fact that forgiveness does not exempt you from punishment. Yeah. I have forgiven him. Thank you, my Thank you. Thanks. Thank, Thank you. you. Hey. I will go to the shrine and undo what I did. Oh, thank you. I leave the rest for God. Thank you. Amanda, thank, thank you. you. God bless much. you. Thank you. Amanda, thank you. Thank you, sir. Papa, thank you. Thank you, sir. Amanda, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Jesus. Jesus. You have a good heart. That's why you are here to let that idiot off the hook. Rape is a sin before the Creator, and you know it. Anybody that is involved in such act is not allowed to live. That's why you left the church. You left the Reverend Father who blessed the scapula, the idiot Thor. Because they will preach to you. Why did you allow them to preach forgiveness to you? Why? Mr. Moore, I didn't know what else to do. I didn't know what to do. Everybody was begging me to forgive him. Everyone begged on his behalf. Besides, he's been mad for years now. He's been running mad for, for a very long time, so uh, I thought it's, it's time I let him loose. It's time I forgive and let him free. Mm. Moreover, the, the preacher said that I should let God be the judge. And I've decided to let God be the judge. If you have made your decision, then let it be the way you have decided. First, you have to go at the back of the shrine, at the root. Bring those clothes, burn them. Then come back and tell Ungele what you want. Thank you, Zemo. I have done it. I have burnt it. You have done well. Hey, Kelly, Mugi. Hmm. What are you going to do when you go to your bar? I'm going to go to your room. I'm going to go to your room. Hmm. I'm going to go to your room. 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 <clears throat> 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 
how the relatives that they have to provide the following items. Seven she goat and seven rams. Before the next two Ekemaket days to appease the shrine of Ungene. Don't go to their house. I repeat, don't go to their house. Send message across to them. Have you had what is required for Nnemeka to regain his senses? Have you had? Papa, calm down. Anyway, I I heard it is seven she goats and oh. seven rams. Oh. But that one is not a problem. It can be provided. Provided by who? Provided by who? Papa, Papa listen to me. Papa, you have me as your only son. And I have Nemeka and Chiamaka as my only blood. Papa, allow us to do what we can do. What happened to Nemeka can happen to anybody. It was just a mistake. Rape is not a mistake. Do not count a rapist as your blood. I've said it. The parents should take care of their children. Just... Hmm. At the point of university level, Nemeka turned to the point of raping a woman. And you want to put your money in the shrine. Women should watch their mouth. Yes! Yes! They should not go binding shoulders with men. No, they get it. Amanda was said to challenge Nemeka. And so? She said a million of Nemeka cannot see her part. And you know what that means? My brother decided to prove her wrong. Though I, I blamed Nemeka, my brother, and I still blamed Amanda too. Yes, it was just a mistake. And just that, he planned on how to rape her. Is he now mad enough? Oh. Ask Sammy, oh. why then did he lose his mentality? Look, my son. Abstain yourself from that issue. Allow Nemeka to carry his own cross. And I will not do that. Papa Adu Mukiko, I will not do that. That boy is my blood. Nemeka. And I will do anything possible to help him. Yes. Are you challenging Papa? I will challenge you. Yes, that boy is my brother. And I will help him. I will help him. Because no mistake. It's just a mistake. Anybody can do it. A rapist cannot be your brother. You see? Mm -hmm. So, what you have done to another ten? In our fear. What would I have done without you people? Mama, she knows so. One name. I am sorry for the disgrace I brought upon this family. I am sorry for the shame that came upon all of you. Amanda dared me. And I wanted to prove to her that I can't do it without minding the consequences. <sighs> this is where it landed me. I've lost my exams. <sighs> I wish I can turn back the heads of time. I just wish. <laughs> Nemeka, you were sent to school to go and study. But you did not. Instead, you were busy looking for, 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 for a woman who would dare you. Of all the women in school or you saw outside, you did not see anybody. It's Amanda you saw. A family friend. Then Nemeka. What did she do to you, Katie, for Maggie? 
she she dared me, and I want to prove to her. If I lied to me, now make you a devil. If only I'm Luana. Look at it. You need to see the way the villagers are looking at you. They, they don't see you as a madman. Only see a drum meeting is also okay, Chacha. And the way the children were running after you, throwing stones and deaths on you. Makanisia drawing ma. He put her back at her Hey, you are sorry. You are a rapist. Yes, I'm sorry. Eh? I don't know what came over me. You don't know what came over oh, you. I don't know what I was thinking. Please. Look at it now. The whole villagers are now looking at you as a madman. When you see her, wrong ma. You need to see the way uh, children in, the, in, in this village run around you, chase you, they clap and follow you and, and throw stones at you. You need to see it. You fell out there, May. Officer, this is the man that stabbed me and raped me. Arrest him. Arrest who? After spending such amounts of money in the shrine? After four years of madness? Ah, are you that wicked? And you think that is enough? Oh, because he was mad for four years, I should just let it go. A man who took my dignity. If you think this is all I will do, then you're in for more. Because I'm just getting started with you. Officers, arrest this man. Commander, why then did you forgive him? And I stamped my foot in that shrine as against my face. The same way I stepped my foot into that shrine against my own wish. Don't you think I'm a Christian too? Oh, you think I'm a pagan? I may have forgiven him, but he has to pay for what he did. He should pay for what he did. The law should take its course. By the time I am done with you, when you see a woman, you respect them. You don't go around raping women. After raping them, you stop them. How dare you? Officers, arrest this man. Arrest this man, please. Young man, you're under arrest for the offense of rape. And I advise you remain silent, for whatever you say or do will be used against you in the court of law. Officer, sir, and coffee. Please, I Officers, sure. please, sir. Officer, I've officer, lost my lesson. I want to please. do my job. Hey! Amanda. Officer, because they're not coffee. coffee. I've lost my lesson. Hey. Hey. Amanda, please. I'm tired of this world.